Black Compass, Black Compass Media. Salute to everybody live, everybody tuning in. You rocking out with the ball, guys. First and foremost, make sure you share the stream. Make sure you share the stream. Run this up. Run this up. Run this up. Share the stream. Yeah, you know, happy Easter. All that good. Big Speaker, what up? I see Big Speaker. Big Speaker, what up? Yeah, you already know the vibes. Black Compass, Black Compass Media. You already know. Drop what you represent. What side of the city you represent. Where you from. You already know the vibes, man. Earn your medals. We in the building. Salute the Army. Salute the Backpack. Salute the Discord. Hey, y'all already know. Good guy gay. We here. I'm feeling good, Polo. We listen. Had a nice little week off. Get away from the people. Let everything simmer down. And you know, a lot of things went on, but not nothing too crazy to make us rush here and get crazy. But we back, man. Salute all the people in the building. Let's get it. Yeah, and uh, we we are we streaming on on multiple platforms right now. So if you're watching us, make sure you sh uh, sh uh share this out. Them s words is crazy. Make sure you share this out. Uh, hit the like, share the stream, and first and foremost, drop where you at in the comments. I see Denver in the building, Chicago in the building, New Orleans in the building, Maryland in the building, Seattle in the building, the Bronx in the building, Boogie Down in the building, Boogie Brazil in the building. Baby. Okay, Brazil. Yeah, what time is it over there? Philly in the building. Philly always in the building, man. Um, six one five Phoenix in the building. Denver in the building. We got about. Oh yeah, the chat is filling up crazy. Pause. It's filling up. Yeah, share this out. Make sure y'all. Money, you know I mean? money club in the building. Okay, <laughs> money. Money Club, stop that cap and hit that cash out. Yeah, Money Club, salute the Money Club. Money, money Club, club in the building. Okay. St. Louis. I ain't going right. to lie, St. Louis. I'm going to keep it real. Y'all about to be, y'all might be a little mad. Hey. Niggas Mike Switzerland in the building. Hey. No listen, diddy. You got to really earn your medals around here. Listen, y'all let people get away with highway murder. But listen, we going to get to it. Feel how you feel. Argue with your mama, boyfriend. Listen, let's get it. <laughs> um, Chicago. We we uh the rock in the building. Yeah, like Cola said. Yeah, it's the, different. The week, the week off was needed. Y'all you know I mean it was Easter week. You know, a lot going on. So we, we I mean, Black Compass took the week off, but we back. I ain't gonna lie. Ain't no more vacations. Ain't no more none of that. I'm locked and loaded. I'm ready to we go. Locked in. I ain't go yeah. I'm, 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 I'm stupid locked in. We, we well super rested. locked in. We locked in and well rested. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I ain't going to lie. We got 200 on the YouTube, about 200 on the, the three, 400 on the Twitter. It's going up. So we got a lot. Um, You got, you kind of said some shit on Twitter right now, man. You kind of, I see. What I, I say? I'm going to read it out. 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 You know, I like to read shit out. Okay. Hold on. Let's get right fucking to it then. Let's get right hold to on, it. Let me go to, hold on. Let me go to the page. Yeah. Shout out Maywood. Yeah. Bellwood. Y'all know the vibe styles. I know what's going on. 290. Yeah. We here. Yeah. Okay. All my niggas off Central. Yeah. We here. What's up? The big speaker in Capital. Said this on Twitter 38 minutes ago. He said, I got ill will winning 3 0, beating verb in his element, and he was rapping good. Argue with your mama boyfriend. Listen, I felt like Will won that battle 3 0. Verb rap well, but it wasn't enough. You seen Jada Kiss versus Dipset? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> It's not enough. Jadakiss <laughs> mean it wasn't enough, bro. Listen, let's let's get to it. Let, I'm gonna let you walk go get into it before I do a whole because I ain't doing no long drawing out nothing, Polo. This is the new me, man. I, I'm earning my medals. Walking down from the perception, I'm gonna tell you every reason okay, why. Okay, so wait, before we get into let me say this before we get into this. Uh -huh. I am one of the people. Ask a verb. I have no reason to hate. I'm gonna say this because I seen somebody on Twitter say you just hate. When he beat a war to me. I said, this is one of the greatest promos and performances ever. So we're not going to do the old Cola being biased and hating, because if I wanted to say that, like a lot of people trying to fake act like A-War beat him, I'd be going that way. So we're going to nullify that right now. But I just paid for the battle. AIP can tell you that if he, if he got the receipts. I just watched the battle at 8.30 Central, 9.30 Eastern. Now we're doing this show. So I'm just telling you how I felt going right now. Let's get it, Polo. Okay, now getting <laughs> we gonna get to that, but before we even get to that, we gotta talk about the face off. We gotta talk about the rollout. Um, 
ARP uh and Averb got into a crazy back and forth. Um yeah. You know, it was some stuff going on before the battle where I think ARP was introduced. Yo, ARP, salute. I know you over there comfy over there. You retire. You got you picking out your bucket hat, your, your polo, what chincletas you want to bring on the beach and all that. But please don't ever in your life do no one-man judge again. I don't know if that was true or not, but that kind of raised a lot of commotion. Uh, He had one judge that was going to be the decider, I think, of performer of the night and battle of the night. Yeah, nah, you can't do that. With that, you got to kind of, wait. if you're going to do it like that, I mean, it's well, technically, I don't know who money it is because they said Gerald paid for the event. I don't know what's, you know what I mean? Uh, I, you, I don't know what's going on. But. Nah, you, you know what's you, going on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Let's get to that. Uh -huh. First of all, they had a big back and forth. Verb, Gerald. Verb got it on fire. Like I say, one of the promo guys. That's undeniable. I ain't even got to, we know what he do with the promo. He can start a fight out of country. The boy different with the promo. But let's get to it. That nigga was talking to AIP real filthy. We not going to skip over that. He was talking to AIP real filthy. Nigga, you ain't paid for this. Doing all this switching the venue. Just it's your car. He was talking crazy to AIP. Like, bro, you he was talking off. back, though. Listen, if, 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 if a nigga wasn't fronting all these good cars and bringing Young Eel out, nigga, what would you have? That's what Vern was talking to. He was talking to AIP like, yeah, my nigga. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't yeah. gonna lie. He, he fake was wild with ARP up. He was wild with ARP up, had bro. to pull back up with a double blog. That's how I knew nigga was getting. Whenever a nigga got to pull up with a double blog, he's getting wild up. He was talking filthy to ARP like he didn't pay for this. Now he's switching venues and one artist and all this. Like he was talking crazy. Then pulled up on him on the show. I think they blog back and forth. Yeah, ARP, you have to bring them St. Louis niggas out. And then we get you your best card. And yeah. Yeah, the <laughs> yeah, Verb might have won. Hey, hey, ARP, I'm gonna keep it a bean. Besides us, you probably you probably really five thousand and three, because we done whooped <laughs> on you twice, and that's the first time I seen the nigga pull up on you. <laughs> nah, for real, ARP five thousand and three. Yeah, he only lost in, in battle rap history. ARP has only lost the base to us and a verb. Those we the only two people to beat ARP we in the debate. To beat ARP, bro. I'm just keeping it a bean. I think a I, I think a verb and I think and don't get me wrong. ARP was throwing haymakers. He was throwing. Hey, did nah, I he, he, was throwing, he was throwing don't some get jazz. Me wrong. I'm gonna keep it a honey. That nigga ARP was on the ropes. He was he was moving on that nigga for a minute. Then verb caught him. I ain't gonna lie, cause Verb had some shit for him. Like, nigga, I ain't gotta show you my face and all. Verb was trying to try to try to try to talk filthy. That exchange, AIP, honestly, that exchange, that was a nasty rollout exchange right before the paper. And then, like, yo, I understand because they did put the battle out the very next day. But my thing is that rollout, like, y'all gotta do a live pay per view. Like, y'all ain't finna be arguing like this with no live pay per view. Like, what is go? But ARP, how do you feel about ARP saying, listen, that shit costs tens of thousands of dollars? Y'all niggas ain't helping me with that. Like, who's who's paying for that? Well, ARP, this is the fuck that URL been telling you what you just think you would slick talking about free battles, but you charging us five to see it. Mm. What happened to all this free shit? Because that's the same thing the app doing. Five, $8 for five ain't that far. So if you're going to do all YouTube drops and then charge us five for the membership, and we pay eight a month for the app, what's the fucking difference? Because mm. it was all this YouTube, this, and for the fans, and we got to pay $5. Why happened to all this free shit? With, that's all what I'm happened? Asking. I don't, I don't think nothing free in battle rap no more. I I'm went just, to listen. I, I'm just saying what they were saying. It's free and niggas charging and they closing. Listen, at the end of the day, YouTube is an app just like URLs app. We had to pay for that. Niggas been paying for that, so I want to nullify that right now. Great battle for the five. I would I paid the five for that. That was a great battle in my opinion. And like that, I, said, I thought Verb did good. We just gonna get to why I think Will made a one every round. And, and then wait, look, one last thing. And then it's like. You, like I'm, this is what I'm confused about $8 because he didn't. Yeah, the five, the five. eight dollars is optional, nigga. You gotta put your card in and pay it. They don't just go into your account and get your routing and account number and say, "Hey, we take a ten for the app." No, you gotta pay for both of them. Both of them is optional. You watching this show is optional. You downloading Twitter was optional. You watching caffeine when the battles was there is optional. You getting the VOD and uh, for the RBE or on fucking rap 
grid is arch is optional, man. What are you what, talking about? So so my my thing that I was confused about with ARP is in one breath, a verb is saying you ain't pay for nothing. And then ARP is kind of saying, nigga, I'm not paying tens of thousands of dollars for the stream. So how come the same person that put up the money for this card just didn't want to introduce the stream? Like, why didn't they go to the... Well, I mean, I don't think it... But but I, I think them not having the stream wasn't a, a, a big deal when they dropped the battle the next day. Like, I can see if they had the battles and did ARP like, hey... They dropped gonna... one battle, though. Okay, and I'm pretty sure another one coming. I'm Listen, for $5... I ain't mad about that one battle. Because like I said, even though I got Will winning, I didn't think a bird rap bad. I, I, it's just things I think he should have done and could have done better. Now, or let's more to his okay. point. That's all I'm saying. So it was worth the five. Yeah, I, I, I ain't going to lie. I think me and you probably got two completely different takes tonight. Okay, let's get to it. All right, let's get into it. Now, the battle drops, a bird versus... um. Uh, uh, ill will. Um, it's a circle battle. Number one, I'm gonna be honest. Salute. We got about 400 in here. I don't really know the Twitter numbers right now. Uh, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look at it. In the, I'm gonna look at it soon. But um, yes. Okay. 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 Bad. Yeah. So the battle drops. Uh, um, the battle drops. ARP. Um, the battle drops the next day in the morning. Five, what was I just saying again? My fault. I got. I got distracted looking at the numbers. What was I just saying? You about to get into the battle. The battle drop. Oh. Okay, you yeah. So a verb, a verb, it will now. The battle drops in the morning, five dollars press. I, first, I'm looking on Twitter. I see everybody on Twitter. I'm like, oh, she dropped the battle for the three skin. Okay, I click. Oh, nah, five dollars. All right, cool. Paid the five. Watching the battle out. Now it's a circle battle. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not really a big fan of these circle battles. Like, I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna be honest. I, I kind of feel like it's not. Let's keep it a hundred. Let's, let's keep it a hundred. Keep... I've been, I've been waiting to do a show. The circle battles is legends only, not recorded. Oh my soul, that's mad powerful legends only. How they do it, how they slow down and math. Oh, nah, yes. it's, <laughs> bro, it's legends only without the without the recording. Let's keep it a hundred, nigga. That's mad powerful. Go back to mad verse method, man. How they do the 360, how they going around all up close and all that. That's legends only, bro. Midnight uh, Madness. Uh, that's midnight man is legends only with a 360. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Let's get to it. I'm I, ready today, y'all. Y'all ain't seen me all week. I got a clip. Let's go. I, okay, well, before we get to battle, yeah, I can't get I can't get with this circle shit. I ain't gonna lie. The circle shit I'm not really feeling. I tried. I'm giving it a chance. I don't like it at all. It make my head hurt. I just want to watch a battle. I don't want to focus on the scenery. I want to focus on the battle. I don't want to see it in slow motion. I, I don't want to see it. I in... fuck with the circle. I ain't gonna lie. I fuck with it. I fuck with that. I ain't gonna lie. I fuck. Salute I fuck to you, but I, 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 I want to see some battle. That shit make me nauseous. Like, I, maybe I I'm getting old. The, I fuck with the battle. I just think it got to be more impactful. I think, like, how bad news and Snake Eyes battle was, it was so much action in it that it, 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 it that you really couldn't pay attention to what was going on. Verb, it, Verb is doing so many pauses in between what he's saying. The camera spin for a half a second. Then he's looking around. Then he start Legends only. It's in that voice mode because it get, it's capturing. But like I said, it's a little throw off when the action is on. Like when Payne was whooping on ear wheel last 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 cir full circle, Payne shit look action packed. Bro, I don't, I, I'm just not trying to see all these railroad tracks, these lights. I I, I got I got all these fucking different nah, team jerseys. Dude, hey, dude, put the avocado on the little thing. Had me crying though. Me and camera. Yeah, you got, like you put, what? You got dude put the avocado like he on the stroller. I was crying. Let's but. get straight to it, man. I ain't gonna lie. I felt like your man was mid. Who? I felt like your Pontiac brother was mid this battle. I okay, felt he was super about, mid. I I yeah, ain't gonna lie. Listen. Listen, how you felt about the first round? Don't just get at ill will. Get oh, no, I'm going to get at both of them. I felt this battle was a midi. I, I okay. felt this battle was a Chris Middleton. I thought this battle was a Chris Middleton. I thought I thought the promo was excellent. Well, honestly, I, I can't even really rate the promo because a verb ARP did all the arguing. I don't know. I, I don't. I, I think Ill Will did one promo video where he like made us. Woo! He did like a sound effect. Cool. Salute. He ain't really do much promo. Um, going into the first round, 
Uh, Aver first round was uh was cool. I, I, how did you call it first? How did you? I want I want to hear how you first called it. First and foremost, listen, bro. We not gonna do all that. When my fucking A War sat back and Verb did all the promo, everybody act like the pros. The promo is phenomenal. He did the same thing for this promo on Verb side for both of their parts. Even for what Ill Will did was dope. We ain't even gonna doubt that because he did the same thing with the white boy. Everybody was like, "Oh, best promo ever." He did sort of the same. Nah, thing. That, that, that 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 promo. Hold up, bro. I let you go. Know. Ahead, go ahead, bro. Hold up. At the same time, what shit going on around here? It was a couple of mixed things with Friday Vince just passed. Shit was dry. Before he just the pulled up from 30, trying to promo this, before he just chopped us out of nowhere, when shit going on. So we're going to get a verb to credit for that. Now, when we get uh -huh. into the battle of the first round, let's keep it all right real spill. We in an element. This is a verb's element. Everybody say ill will don't supposed to be in this element. Now, I don't know if y'all watched this battle in the rush, but I thought this was a particularly a good battle. Rapping wise, I thought it was a good battle. Setting wise, I thought it was a good battle. But this is why I tell you. First of all, Bert, you can't do this type of promo. You can't do this type of talk shit talking. You can't do it in, in your element and rap Big K rounds. You can't rap old Big K rounds in your element where you say you get busy. Three minute rounds, they ain't booked you for a long time. This is your element. You've been preaching to everybody all fucking week. I'm finna burn this nigga. Burn this nigga is not 130. It's not. It's not 130. And as well. Verb, you got to get out of this. I'm just going to rap about how good I am and how marvel of a, of a man that I am shit. Like all this, I'm not attacking my opponent. I'm just going to tell you how I'm just better than you shit. It got to cut it out. You have to cut it out, bro. No. -war, you got to get back to that A-War shit. You went back to that with Mickey Facts because that was a mixed thinker, but they let you live up on that because niggas is with the Lord because you show up every day, niggas want a speaker. Cool. You and Mickey wasn't really like that, nor was you really in this battle because it's 1.30. You got big K rounds, bro. You ain't even give us an old smack 3.30 Midwest Miles, you versus Midwest Miles type of round. And you land in your plane flat because after you get get to get your shit going, it's like, you go. Like, what is that? In a wheel of that bitch with 3.30s. Clip uh, up. Nah, it'll real bad for like 2.20. His, 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 his material is directly to you. He island flip. I ain't like a lot. He flipping that island shit from every island. Hawaii island, San Jose, motherfucking uh, Turcos. He on every island with you. He on every island with you. Wow, I had big. I had ill will winning that first round. Clear. What we debating? Hey, you got ill will winning the first. Man, I got ill will winning the first. Man, y'all let three letter man get on there and do that. Man, I heard Verb ever like this in the third. Wow, he surprising me. That's his sidekick. Man, all that shit fluff. That first was light as shit, man. <laughs> no, Y'all don't niggas no, wake no, up. No, and it's no. you niggas, man. You niggas woke up early in the morning lying. Oh, lying. Oh, my God. This, this, this. No, it wasn't, bro. This bro. This battle was ass. Like, I'm going to be honest. I thought the Will shit was just as bad. Like, I thought both of they shit wasn't really think, like. No, 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 no. Ill Will no, shit was not no, that good, no, bro. No, no. He, he, had, a, he had a lot of OBC dragged out the island shit. He had a bunch of. uh. No. It wasn't. Eh, it no, wasn't bro. that, bro. Will was in that bitch cooking. I had Hitman losing to him. I had him beating. I had Hitman him losing to Hitman. But he beat a bird, bro. He beat that man, G. In that setting, on short prep. A short announcement and all that. that, that, that that's that's in the act that. Now, that's what I'm saying. They gave us a good enough show on the prep time that they had with the announcement or what they gave us. Because what we just I, had I see way around, better in the wheels than besides, this. Besides, besides what Tay Rock been doing with niggas and a couple of other battles and salute my, my, my TOS family and all of them and what Black Ice Cartel just did, motherfuckers ain't really been on Nate. Thank you, Jenkins, man. So for what it was worth, dope battle. But let's keep it a fucking honey. That nigga verb wasn't in that really too. Was he rapping very well? He's gonna do that. But was he saying you didn't like his show time? That was the third round. I know, but I mean, I think I, I mean you kind of said we who you got winning, got so I'm trying to yeah, we ain't even got that, but at that point, I still feel like Will did more in the third. So you got it as a 30, like a dead. I got Will 3 0 and verb element. I thought I thought I thought he ed I ain't said he beat the fuck out of him. But I feel like Will is every round, bro. Yeah, I mean, I, I gave Verd the first. I gave Ill definitely got the second. He was in the, Ill Will was in there cooking with the bacon neck collar. Yeah, bro, he, listen, that's what niggas get. Listen, the fucked up part about it is this. 
Niggas keep saying a verse first, a verse first, but his first was okay. His second, if you go back to his second, his second actually was better than his first. Hell no. Man, to me, his I second, just, I just watched it. His second, I ain't hell it this no. I just watched it. His first was, I thought his first, he had more energy, was controlling the tempo. He was going around the room. He was looking at the kid. I thought his first was crazy. I thought, I, I just didn't like the way he landed his plane. Pause, no diddy. I didn't like the way he landed his plane. I thought I thought the way he Bro, landed it. I thought it was a good battle. I just thought Will was more direct. He did I don't think it was a dirty. I gave Verb the first. I gave Will a second. And it really come down to who you gave the it third come to. come down to what? The man had one thirties. Bro, it, Will was not that crazy to me. Bro, like, I don't, was, bro, it ain't about Will being that crazy. Was Will better than his opponent? It's not about if Will was that crazy to you. It's if Will beat his opponent, bro. You trying to judge him on how crazy he was to it's you. A, no, it's was a he mid better battle. than Averb? Like, if I had was to be better than Averb, gun bro? to my head, gun to my head. Hold up, hold up, gun to my head. I give it to Ill Will, but. I, I I give it ill will. I'm not gonna say, but I, it's, it's not excited. It was not really. It did not live up to the hype. Yeah, well, well, it, it, no, I'm saying this battle did not live up to the hype to me. If it lived up, we discussing who won the battle right now. I know, but boy, we can't. I'm not really about to deep dive into this. Like like you want to do a deep dive into this? Like I'm no, talking I ain't to breaking no bars down because you went first. Oh. Right you gonna say how I felt about the battle? Oh, you yeah, said first because you. you I mean, but you you kind of overall came out and said you had a 30 off it. So that's yeah, why I'm like. you read the tweet. So you already knew that. Duh. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. So, now we got, what you... so once I tell you I got a 30, we got to do some type of dive because we got to get yeah, so that, oh, okay. I got so, 30. Okay, so, so this is what I'm trying to. You ain't trying to deep dive. No. What I'm trying to say is because you sound like you're trying to break down this first round for 30 minutes. Boy, let's get to the. No, let's I get already to the had the 30. You said the first round. I already told you. I got, if you gun to my you head, ran. gun to my head, I get gun to my head. I give it ill will to. I don't see a thirty. I can't really see a thirty. I, like that'd be that's crazy. And, and that's fine. It, and it may be crazy, but go watch the battle. Who lost? Let me chat. Y'all in here? We got about six hundred in the YouTube. About like six hundred on Twitter. Who y'all got? Uh, what? Who do y'all got? Like, how, how did y'all call in this? Do y'all have verb? Y'all got ill will. How y'all calling this? I need to know. Yeah, don't now, be scared. Don't be scared if y'all think a motherfucker gonna open the space up and cook y'all. Yeah, don't be scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. That third where? The man just go. Every time he ended his plan into a into a uh into a wall. Stop it. Yeah, nigga, we got six hundred. Can you can you, can you can you see, nigga? We got six hundred. Are you six hundred on here? We ain't we ain't even counting the Twitter yet. The Twitter, but um, okay. I see. I ain't gonna lie. I see some verbs. I see some ill wills. I see a lot. I see one ill will too. I see a lot of ill wills. Two ones. Way 30s. more wills than verbs, man. We ain't gotta. We it's ain't definitely gotta, more ill wills than verbs. Casanova, will... Ka Casanova put wills six times. I mean, put verbs six times. Like that's him six times. Yeah. Nasty work. Nah, nah, I'm, okay. I see Toast got verse, Sniper, Show, Problem. It's some verb. It's some verb. It's look some at people here. Go to all messages. Fuck that. Fuck that top messages. Click the all messages. Will, will, will. It's a will, lot of ill wills, will. but I, I called it a two one. It's a lot of two ones. I, I, I didn't really see a thirty for me to have a thirty every round. Nigga had to get walked okay, down. Okay, okay. Even if it wasn't a thirty to you, I ain't arguing that. I ain't hell bent on that. Ill will just beat Verb in his element, not in a good battle to you, but he beat the nigga that's supposed to be incredible in this element, in his element. Let's get to that. Mm. Let's get to the battle rap shit. That's supposed to be Verb element. He was saying Ill will. Okay, I see. I, okay, I see what you're saying now. Okay. Saying. Let's, get to, let's get to the particulars of that. That's what we break it down because he's supposed to be a god in this element. The best, the better writer, they say. The bet, the one with the better pen. He's just let the performer, nigga, they say. That don't supposed to be in these rooms that need the big crowd come and beat him in his element and probably outperformed him with his damn collar on his chest. Ill will in that spinning on a verb with his collar on his chest. And verb, you gotta stop whipping them number one pet leathers out. You gotta get a different <laughs> pair of number one George. What? 
Yo, I don't know how to pose. No, Diddy, I don't know how to do a poll. Like, Tone, if you know how to do the, um, put the poll up in here, you're more than welcome to, please, if if you can. Uh, or you know, any mod, Bob, if you Bob, can, not, any mods in here. There's always some out bar for bar. You niggas not even rappers. Yeah, bar like, bar, what? I hate when niggas like, say that bar for bar, bar shit. For bar. I hate you that. Like, like, man, get the, it's about the whole play. movie, nigga. You tell me, well, it, 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 for these two scenes, it was a better. No, nigga, it's the movie in its entirety. The movie in this in its entirety was not that. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I, yeah. I will say that I, I ain't going for it. I don't know. So you saying the circle is his element? I thought more so the small room, like so the blue room that and the circle room is true. To, but they had that circle shit though. Bro, I ain't no circle shit. Only thing, only thing, uh, all battle rap, uh, fucking crowds is a circle. You on the stage and then we circle around. Nah, only boy, thing, battle only rap crowds is not no bro, circle, only boy. Thing different, you're only not going thing around different. the stage. Bro, listen, listen, bro. Only thing different, <laughs> only thing different about that is avocado spinning around. We're not doing that. Let's get to the raps, nigga. You and that room me. got mad echo, bro. And you niggas gonna stop trying to act like y'all just super producers, like you motherfuckers want watching Back to the Future in '92. Get y'all all y'all niggas act like y'all don't do that, Marty you McFly. Niggas, that's, that's, that's the classic. That's what I'm saying. But look how it was filmed, nigga. You niggas keep acting like y'all been watching HD and super high quality film shit, like y'all Steven Spielberg and shoot movies. Man, y'all niggas just worry about the words and what's going on. Stop acting like y'all set. Nah, cut, nah you can't charge me for a service Man, to tell me just worry about me, the bro. words. I swear to God, <laughs> these you motherfucking bloggers that get me segments and start doing these motherfucking. Hey, when a camera quality nigga act like he shot an action packed movie before this high is supposed to be shot. Nigga, you ain't film nothing or, or, nah, or even get nigga. an interview with a camera. Nigga trying to act like he did. Nigga put his camera up on himself and get a blog. Now you act like a cameraman, a Noah Avocado, or these niggas that shoot 4K clips and these niggas that shoot movies supposed to do. Get y'all ass out of here, man. Nigga, tell me about the camera quality cry. and all this no crazy way. ass shit, man. I'm tired of you non-productive, never shot a movie, never shot a music video ass niggas trying to tell me what the what the quality of the video is supposed to do instead of the raps. I just feel like the circle shit for me personally, oh, man, it just give me a, it just it just give me a These headache, niggas, man. man. It is that, oh, he shot it so well. But like, you can't get mad at the people for not liking the circle if they don't like it or if they do man, if they you don't. Niggas, man, you listen, bro. You niggas play Nintendo, Super Nintendo, and Satan Genesis. You see Classic. the graphics on that. You niggas ain't got no problem with what's Man, watch the battle, man. <laughs> Nigga, avocado, you should use this in a commercial. <laughs> for real, man. These niggas trying to act like... Battle. Niggas trying to act like they just, they just super, super like... Like they, like they, they TV to turn with a nod. All right, let, let's man, you niggas from the eighties, man. You niggas just now, trying to, you niggas have to fix out TV with a hanger. You talking about quality? Yo, let's not go back to them days. Niggas don't niggas remember them to days. Fix that TV with a hanger. You had to smack the back of you your TV. You don't remember quality. them days. You don't remember them days, ass niggas. You niggas bougie as fuck, man. I still keep a metal hanger just in case. Um, now. Okay, so you said okay. So now you you so you you think that this battle because I see Swamp is now came out and he feel like A Verb is lost. Also, they going back and forth. Do you feel like A Verb is going to be better versus Swamp than he's ver than he was? Or what what is the problem that you feel like A Verb is not translating to how he was in the previous A Verb? I just I just feel like in the promo that he did for this battle, like he did for A War battle. When he came in that motherfucking A War battle, and it's up, it's up standards. Now he may say, "Cole, who the fuck are you to have a standard on me? I'm no verb, but it's the standard you presented to us of yourself. So when you put yourself up here, I'm holding you up to what you did too. You and Mickey Facts, I know that's like your guy. So I ain't really put too much on that. So when you did that one, it wasn't really like, oh, let me come out and say something. But when you do the promo behind it, like you did with A War, I ain't gonna lie, what he did with A War to me was what was, was, was fucking fantastic, amazing. It was like that, bro. It was an album. Gritty voice, nasty. But then when you come in, you popping that same shit. I'm gonna smoke your boy. You arguing with AIP, and then you come in here and got big KO rounds, one thirties. Nah, I gotta holler at you. No, I got, in your element, I gotta holler at you. No, I don't give a fuck about none of that too, cause you ain't had no battles and nothing like that, like that. You, it wasn't no yeah. way you supposed. It, it wasn't no way. This your element, and I feel like Will captured more of the element. I, I, I thought he attacked a bird more in a battle rap style, and I thought he was just better per round. I ain't saying a bird was bad. I thought he was good, but I thought 
ill will did more. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I, I, I ain't mad at that. I, I ain't really mad at that take, to be honest. I also feel like um, if Verb is going to like be in like these cage matches, kind of, then he got to make sure the material is like at the, t for me, he got to make sure the material is top notch. And uh, and that, that's really it, to be honest. Even though I ain't going front, I, I thought, I thought it would, but why everybody keeps saying it's a short battle? Like when, when did, uh, how much time did they have to prepare for this battle? I thought that I thought ill will Gerald was trying to set this up since last only, year. It was only a short battle on Verb's side. Verb got straight to the point. He got these he got these these pauses where it's like what he like doing this old uh Captain America walk matrix thing. But other than that, I felt like ill will be him, bro, in his element. I thought ill will wrote very well, he attacked him. He brought up shit about Midwest. He, he, he was very direct. Like I said, I think A Verb is rapping real good, but A Verb is only rapping talking about what he does. He ain't there because you he don't give a fuck that you there. He may say ill will and may mention something in there, but for the most part of that shit, A Verb rapping about this is how much I'm better than you, and I don't even know why you here basically. Like mm. I'm not even here to talk to you. I'm just here to tell the people. Yeah, that he gotta get back to that. Yeah, he in that polo. You gotta get that, back to them, them them guardian angel metaphors. The uh like he, he gotta get back to some of his classic work. And I I hate when people say that because like you want old whole shit, old shit by the old album type shit. But in certain in certain cases, the old shit help. Like I think he gotta get back in that pocket. I think uh his material is like very uh like glorifying himself. That's it. <laughs> and it, and it's like you got to get back to that old verb that, that, when the last time you see, like, you got to get back in that bag. We was talking to nerve, nor, norms and math. Like, you got to get back in that bag. It's That's still there. Will, you fuck with them bottom bitches. I fuck with all the bitches to the tall bitches. Like, he just, just he just what, say something to you. Like, I would have been, I would have been cooking Ill Will shirt because Ill Will shirt was, was wrinkled as hell. Bro, like, he, Ill Will, Ill Will, <laughs> you my man of honey grand. I don't know how the fuck that's top of that shirt one iron. Like you just landed and just said, like, fuck it. This the one. <laughs> Ill will. Ill will, you my man. You picked that shirt up and said, and we all have fucked up days, Ill will. So I ain't saying I ain't had mine. Well, you may can't find a picture where I had a fucked up day. But you had, first of all, you had a, your shirt. I just, you popped that bitch out the suitcase. This the one. That is then you, this the one. Then you had that. Then you had that gun ball machine ass chain on. Ill will cut it out. Your chain was gut. You ain't even have a charm on that motherfucker. At least you could have had a little charm on that motherfucker. You had a gun ball machine and your, and, and your collar was like this. You're wrapping your whole first round. <laughs> Ill will like this. Ill will. Your whole first round is like this. Bro, your whole first round. Ill will. You're wrapping like this, bro. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm about to fuck my sweat up fucking with you. Your whole first round was like that. Bro, bro that you pulled bro, that the least, you pulled the least pulled your shirt back to make it look like it, it fit on your neck. That motherfucker was on your chest, bro. I'm going to keep it a stack. I gave a the first off that alone. That had me hot. I ain't going to lie. That, that's why y'all think ill will. But, bro, the man, this how, is this how ill will. Hey, pull up. This is how ill will look. His chain was like this. This how ill will. You see how his chain with no charm? Y'all see how literally his chain is with no charm? This how ill will look. I cry. Yo, ill will. I send me your P.O. box, my boy. I'm going to get you right. Fresh out fresh out the box. Like, come on, ill he will. Rat, you wailing the hell out. Uh, did you lost that first round of GP alone. I ain't know if y'all fought before the battle. I don't know what happened. Oh, my baby, you came in like you just was wrestling with Mac Myron before that battle. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga like you just Look. in the back wrestling. He, nigga, did you wrestle with what shirt you was wearing? Wait, hey, you know you you shirt? <laughs> hey, hey, Polo, you know how you put a shirt on? You're like, fuck that, this ain't the one. You take it off, you put some other shit on. Then you like, you see how I just fucked with this shirt and it's getting fucked up? Bro, you gotta bro, it, be confident in your outfit, bro, and wear your <laughs> shit, bro. Yo, listen, he was wet. He was wilding out. I ain't gonna lie. That that shit right there was that shit right there was egregious. And it ain't about name brands. It ain't about it ain't about none of that. But just look presentable, hey, man. Hit an iron on that. Hey, that earn your metal. Listen, that earn your metal shit. We back up. 
I'm printing and pressing myself now. It's lit. You need a package? Get up with your boy. We're earning our medals. I got all colors, all assortments, different type of arrangements, city teams, all that. Get with your boy. Shout out Bino, Henry, everybody, my mom, my, my people. Listen, sweaters on the way. I got y'all some exclusive in the package too. We 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 working. We back back. All my 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 Kareem's, all my boy Rob. I got y'all. Listen, we back back. Your boy printing and pressing himself. It's lit. Okay, now, uh, so now another news off of that. Okay, so we we pretty much kind of had the same opinion. Whether three zero two one, we both had kind of ill will. Um, now let's get to it. ARP. Over the week, it's more announcements came out. Well, over the week last week, ARP announces. Oh yeah, hit that gas! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We in that bag tonight. <laughs> um, ARP announced he retired. He's retiring from Battle Rap. He announced that he will he will no longer be a part of a, um RBE like that. Maybe in the future, he still want to do business with Loaded Lux. He said he'll do some business with Loaded Lux, but besides that, he don't really want to um pop out no more he's done with it um how you how you feel before i get into how i feel about it how you feeling about it i'm gonna keep it 100 all bullshit aside bro it takes a lot to book 12 to maybe 14 battle rappers fly them out pay them hotel room them do a live stream make sure they get to an event hoping a nigga don't cancel for 10 straight years, I'm going to be all the way honest. That's a fucking lot, bro. Especially if a nigga try to, get, try to have kids, build a family, do other things. Like, bro, this shit consuming as well because you're dealing with a lot of different personalities, shit back and forth. I understand it, bro. The man ain't got nothing to prove nor gain. If he going to say, okay, I ain't doing the PPVs, I'm going to come out, drop some full circles, which I said. The ill will of everybody was fighting me. I just think, like, I feel like we'll want air round. Did he overbeat him? No. Did he beat his ass? No. I think he edged every round, in my opinion. I think it was a dope battle. I think him doing that, putting shit out, little surprising battles, like, of course, some of this shit not going to be good. We can't blame, really, the league. We got to blame the artists, because all they can do is book them and put them on a platform. Niggas got to rap and show up and do their job at the end of the day. So I ain't mad at that about you falling back, because that shit costs. Booking rap grid and all these niggas to stream these pay-per-views, that shit costs. I ain't never... Uh, did a pay-per-view stream, nor do I know the cost is it to throw an event or host a whole event. So I ain't gonna act like all oh, niggas. Are no, you do as you as you see uh, fit for what your pockets or what you think your time allows. Yeah, so, so yeah, so um, a hundred percent. Um, well, with pay-per-views, it all goes by like the bandwidth and like all that. That like that's how the pricing usually goes, but and it's very expensive. It really just depends on what, like you know what I mean. It's very expensive, so I understand. He just seemed like he had a point where he felt like he made what he could make out of this. Um, he solidified his name in this. He solidified his company's name in battle rap, and I just feel like he had a point now where he ready to move on to the next chapter of his life. Whether it's uh whatever you know whatever type of blogs or whatever type whatever he's ready to move on to the next chapter of his life. And I can't really be mad at that, to be honest with you. Um, I, I mean, it it is kind of it's a tough way to retire when, especially when your company is coming off the best year to a lot of people, to the fans, to a lot of people that watch this and tune in. We got almost eight hundred in here, uh, almost five hundred on Twitter, make uh, all across platforms about fourteen hundred. So salute to everybody. Hit the likes. We need everybody to run these likes up. Um, yeah. So I, I don't know, man. I, th I think he definitely he. He, I just didn't like the timing. The year, last year, he had a crazy year. Um, That was the top year. You're supposed to leave on a high horse. That is true. You're supposed to leave on your best foot forward out the door. But I just feel like with the year he finally had, plus with URL coming out in the beginning of the year and saying, listen, we ain't giving out no more big bags. We ain't fighting for no more crazy battles. If y'all want to, whatever, if y'all ain't liking what we like, go about your business. I thought this year would have been a perfect year to kind of really like, solidify that number like you know what i mean knock knock out that number one spot but uh, maybe he's at a point where he just feel like yo last year was 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 the year for him like you know what i mean like that was that was the best product he could probably give um it is tough though because now it's like when you when you lose like somebody like arp out of battle rap it is like say what you want about arp he gives you the matchups you want to see um he, he you know he always tries to give you a good event 
you know, shit like URL do, all the leagues do. I just feel like like what you said earlier, it falls on the battle list. Listen, bro. That uh -huh. ARP said, ARP pulled the Nick Saban on the low. He said, this shit was cool when we could compete for talent, just scholarships. These <laughs> niggas out here getting out NIL deals. I'm not fighting with that shit. Hey, that nigga said, you are real giving niggas NILs. Name, is it, name image, and likeness. Nigga taking niggas off scholarship. Nigga getting a battle. Nigga, hey, I got 5,000. Nigga gave you two. Nigga just fucking events up. I ain't got time for that. I gave y'all an incredible year. I gave y'all a dime in this shit. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm forever legend. What we did will forever remember, be remembered. We did star and fives, blood, sweat, and tears. We did different type of events. Uh, the Hitman, Cassidy cards. What do I have to? What else? I'm going to let these people have that shit. I made my money. I'm going to do my one-two off the love of this shit. I'm going into other endeavors. It's no other difference than somebody when they sell a company or they done with something. He just done with this shit, and you can't be. Man, I might want to start a family. I don't even yeah. know what ARP got kids. Man, go ask some fucking kids, ARP. <laughs> um yeah like uh he said he will be more involved in the full circles but in my honest opinion um i think y'all should just do the what y'all doing with the full circle i think y'all should try out just doing the blue room or just like doing trying to do the blue room like the, i understand max out you kind of want to leave the blue room with that memory like yo that's the last time we was in the blue room all that but I think that was a you know what I mean that was something fire that was that was something fire that you kind of cooked up on year twenty one like you know what I mean and, 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 and I'm gonna say this I'm gonna keep it hundred with y'all now I be paying for a lot of these events I'm gonna, I'm gonna holler at you bricks hey bricks I love y'all to death and salute with my sister Wayne doing over there but bro y'all want me breaking down this shit Black Combs bring energy y'all gotta send me a VOD all this cola you gotta pay and break it down and uplift and all this. Y'all got to send a VOD. I'm somebody. I work for this shit four years in. I'm not doing all this, pay my money and fly out and do all this shit. Man, you want me to overdo what you need to do? Hope, book me for hosting or send me a VOD. All this shit y'all trying to do and all act a fool with. Man, send me that motherfucking, uh, that, 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 uh, bricks, brick by brick VOD with Goody and them. Hey, I, I'm gonna break the whole card down. All this go buy it and pay for it, Cole. At this stage, I'm done. I'm letting y'all know right now. I'm the big speaker for a reason. I bring exposure to the exposure. I'm gonna bring payments to the payments. Yeah, they definitely. Uh, I mean, yeah, I That's feel like for some of the newer joints, y'all that like I ain't gonna front. I, 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 hold on, hold on. I will say this though: a lot of the. A lot of the, a lot of the leagues that, a lot of the, some of the leagues have, like the smaller leagues have been reaching out, like, yo, listen, we need some, uh, promo or woo -woo -woo, whatever. So I definitely want to do give them shout out, but 100% agree with you on that. Um, niggas definitely should start sending the VOD. Um, battle no, rap going against the competition between the leagues. Y'all made that competition, like y'all for the. I feel like the fans, everybody, the battlers, everybody just forced these two leagues at it. So now. Y'all you know I mean it, I think it's kind of done. The war is done. Real bro, I'm quick, not for none of them small leagues no more. On my baby, you want me, man? I, I do. I put hard work in this shit. I cover your shit. I break down valuable, valuable time. All I'm asking is send it, and then I'm gonna watch all this. You gotta go watch it. Then you want me to break it down. Then you ask me why I ain't did it. So that's like you fucking tagging me in a hundred posts on Twitter while I got a lead conversation because y'all fucking my Twitter algorithm up. Which I can't complain because y'all promoting like a motherfucker. And I like it. Do that same time with a VOD. Hey, Cole, check this VOD out because I need you to. All this other shit. I ain't... Then when you get big stage, you do a blue room or a full circle, I'm going to pay my five like I just did for Averb and Neil Will. Now, what do you feel about Charlie Clips no show in jail? Well, I think he, if I'm not mistaken, they said he showed up to LA, but he was sick, so he didn't battle. Who he How you feel? Battle? Jag. Oh, I'm not. Wait, I told y'all that was going. I, hey, listen, I'm letting you know right now, Polo. Hey, world, I'm letting y'all know right now. Love clips to death. Legend forever. I'm done with clips. I'm done. I got a 38 right now. I got six bullets. Fuck a clip. I'm in the chamber. I'm done. You, know, you, you, you right done now. with clips? I got 32s and 38s. If easy and clip good announce, you care I'm about that battle? Clips. All revolvers. I'm done with clips, man. Give me the revolver. No shell cases, no shell cases, no trace. Give me the motherfucking revolver. I'm done with clips. 
Yeah, I ain't going. Did he actually wait? But this is my thing. He showed up to LA like he got a got the flight to LA and was just like, nah, fuck it. I don't feel like that. Listen, listen, Tone. This, I mean, Polo. This is what I'm saying, bro. I know he full blown comedian now. That old clips when he was still with Mysterio when he was gun buttoning, it still was believable. The fact that now I see him cracking a thousand jokes when clips getting in a pistol weapon, man. I'm like, bro, no, 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 bro. It just don't, it just don't translate like that old clips, Tay Rock from the clips versus verb, some of madness, because he still had the lure of who is he? Fred the Godson is man. He came up in Harlem. He still had the lure. All uh -huh. clips now is a full-blown comedian. I can't see nothing else, bro. I'm done with clips, bro. All his flashes in a pan have never been clip standard. Clip standard has been one of the best niggas to ever do this shit. What the fuck happened to Surf Day? This guess what room I'm in. That's what clips been. All this show up, give me a spark clip shit has never been what I have expected of clips because that's never what he have shown and displayed from the first day we seen him. I ain't trying to get all that shit. Nigga said he done with clips and throw up boy. Who yo, who throw up boy? Like that's crazy. Yes. Fuck you talking about who they talking about. I love Chester Dell, but I'm tired. I'm tired of arguing with niggas about the fight with niggas about how good you is and you the next nigga and you how much you done did this and then you get up there and fuck up. No, nah, bro. I'm tired of getting whooped on and for then, this too. And nah. I ain't gonna lie. Boy don't got no throw up etiquette either. My boy will throw up right in the middle of the dance nah, floor. Oh, bro. Fuck that, bro. <laughs> boy ain't got no throw up etiquette. Oh, shit, um, okay, so. so think about it, Polo. Real quick. Because as bloggers, when we fuck up, Niggas be quick to call us cornballs. Tell us when we fucked up. Hey, nigga did this, nigga edit. No, G. You niggas got to do the job of fucking battle rap or get out of here. If y'all don't want no harsh uh, critiques, shout out Chess. Gun titles, what up? Free the way. Tay Rock, all whatever, whatever. But at the same time, the, 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 the what the standard of battle rap is, is do the fucking job, bro. Not you so, get you 25. Why, why we here bro. real quick? Why we here real quick? Because I, I did. I, I do got to take some blame. Into, well, not no blame. I posted this clip. Of, and one of these clips went super viral. The boss and Yoshi. Before we get into Stan, I want to say this. The boss and Yoshi. It was arguing in spaces. Hey, verb. I don't know how shit went super left. Y'all got to stop it. Like y'all, y'all in y'all in spaces. Like the first one was cool, but y'all got to stop this back and forth, man. Y'all niggas don't get on. Have to get on the phone or something, cause y'all just gonna end up saying any 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 business you done heard or ever thought about. Y'all gonna end up arguing and saying that in spaces. Yo, she wild on the line for saying that about the wave. Come on now. We wilding well, out. Well, well they gotta first, stop. Well, first of all, Yoshi, you gotta understand the balls come from the big speaker tree. You're not winning that. The balls come from the big speaker tree. You're not winning that. She trained with the greatest. She didn't train with one of the, the both didn't train with one of the great. I know y'all see her over there waking bank and she around here popping us. She trained with the greatest. I had it in the dojo. I had the boss in the dojo getting her karate right. Now she out here whooping that ass. You're not winning no face off back and forth. She trained with one of the greatest, man. It's the big speaker for a reason. Y'all forgot? Y'all forgot me and Polo. I thought, yeah, I, thought, I thought it was a good back and forth, the first one. The first one I thought, but I thought the, I thought it was a good back and forth. But I thought the boss was wild out for saying, "Bro, y'all not listen, Yoshi, you not beating no motherfucking bro. It's a lot of y'all not beating no the boss. She trained with one of the greatest man, co-host, big speaker. She trained with one of the greatest, self-validated. You know, if I hit the boss, what's my slogan? Self-valid. We 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 got slogans and shit. She trained with one of the best." Yo, you can't. Yeah, I, I ain't gonna lie though. I'm not going. Hold up, I'm not doing that all the way though. I like salute the boss. Yo, she was holding her own in the first one. I thought the one today was nasty work. The first one, she had. They both had solid points. I thought Yoshi point was hold up. I thought Yoshi point was just saying like, listen, you allowed to be biased for your people. Why can't I be biased for my people? You know what I mean? In these debates, they both was making good points. Yo, the boss was saying, um, you know, the boss was like, yo. You ain't got to call me out my name to debate me. Like, I, I completely understood what the boss was saying. So they both was making good points. Bro, when you start trying to say, when you start trying to tell 
who fucked to her? Who yeah, you lost. You lost. You lost. You lost. lost. It's over. You're, you're automatic. And Once you say like, 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 like they rebuttal game crazy. Shout out a war. The boss trained with some of the best, bro. Polo, we, we, Polo, you forgot. Oh, yeah, Atlanta. The boss, Polo, the, you the forgot. Boss Atlanta, under the wing. Atlanta. She know that. Under the chicken spot. Under the, under the wing chicken spot. Under the wing chicken spot. She know She's what's one up. of the coldest with this shit, bro. You, she you cannot bring up sex in a debate. Oh, well, God, salute to them. That's the bedroom. You once you bring the bedroom into the public room, you're lost, bro. You not beating no debugs, bro. She cold with this shit, slick with this shit, folk. She, you gotta be a dog to fuck with. You I ain't gonna lie, that's her. That 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 angle, that bedroom angle, was like a little bit like the Ken Shamrock. Like that, that was that was a, that was that was a nice little. If but she would have to be able to prove that. That's the next part. Now what you now what's gonna happen? Now what what's gonna happen when a wave actually hit the city and, and, and be like, hey, 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 Yoshi, you know how he used to wild Yoshi up. I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm saying I, I hear a lot of y'all too. A verb, I hear you. And I get it. I hear a lot of y'all trying to throw a little search lander here and there with the boss and them, and y'all talking to the ladies and that shit riding. I hear y'all. I've been chilling out the spaces, but I'm going to return on some shit. Y'all keep playing with my homeboy, man. I'm going to keep it real. Free the wave is all y'all should be saying. All these allegations, all these these motherfucking uh, different type of who did what. Y'all out of pocket. You should be trying to Way out of pocket. books and free the wave, man. You Period. Y'all still, still behind that wall. Y'all need that man name for clout. You're not. Mm. Your reach ain't long enough, youngin'. <laughs> Fella is an army, better yet a navy. Navy. You kidnap your mama, shit at your lady. Hey, uh -huh. that's all I'm saying, bro. Stop talking about dude. Let dude do his time peacefully, and y'all do what y'all do. But at the same time, boss, she up. No need for a battle. She trained with the best. Yeah, and, yo, and, and, and like, yo, like, that's a lose-lose debate for you, Yoshi. It's like, you're a battle rapper, you an artist, and at the end of the day, you're yelling at a fan. So it's like, you, you, you know, that's like, that's a lose lose. That you know what I mean? That's some situation you just let it go, man. Because if one breath, if you saying what she say don't matter, you can't call her biased, so you can't get at her for being biased if what she say don't matter. If what I say don't matter, why does it matter if I'm biased or not? Because what she say matter to you. So you got to be real with yourself, you know what I mean? Um hit the likes. Number 1, like real quick commercial real quick. Uh quick commercial. Uh, drugs DBRC. Hit the likes button. Sign, not the heart. To the right of the chat box. Show the platform your support. It's free, hundred percent. Um, one thousand percent. Yeah. Now we didn't. We missed a lot of the events last week. We didn't get to recap them because we we took a you know I mean we took up. a week off. Huh? Oh, you get to that? Yeah, yeah. It was a dope event. Just happened. Shout out my home league, city league. As well as Smoke Room, as well as Danger Zone, as well as North Coast, as well as Gorilla Warfare. Shout out TOS, Solid Four Lucci. Shout out Tati. Shout out everything they doing over there. Dope Car. Everything went on there. We not gonna skip over my boy Merlo. Let's get to it, part of show. We not gonna skip over my boy Merlo. Just caught a dub over a DMV nigga. Now I know y'all think this Midwest DMV shit dead, and they want to sweep it over the carpet. But I think we just went up one. I think we just got us one. Now I'm gonna keep it a bean. Now, we'll keep it a bean. Now, we'll say one, one, maybe, because I feel like Prep kind of is Duke the Shooter, in my opinion. I like what Dirty Prep was doing a little bit more. Shout out Duke. Duke putting on for the city. Now, he is a DMV representative as well. Duke the Shooter, a shot racket. So, if I want to say we went 500, cool. But Merlo did clip Cuban, and I need that to be known. Also, my boy Tanner. Now, Tanner. You come through here because I'm going to do a side. I'm doing this real quick side note. Tanner, you can't be coming in these motherfucking spaces saying you one of the newest niggas in the Midwest, this, 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 and the third, and you get to choking in the shit, bro. You up there mm. choking, bro. You, you're on the live stream YouTube. You popping it. Now, listen, Midwest love, but I got to do my job. Midwest ain't got nothing to do with Black Compass Media and my perspective as a blogger. And as a blogger, the job I need to do is you ain't doing your fucking job, Tanner. If you the new mm. wave of this shit, you got to maximize on every moment you seen on that, that 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 stream live. Fuck these spaces. All that space shit be cool. 
But when you get the Entasi and them put you in front of that live stream, you can't be up there, oh, damn, this, 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 especially in these type of battles, bro. Fuck is you doing up there, Tanner? And it's, it's another two cards I want to get to real quick. I ain't going to lie. Wow. Now, I ain't see the whole card, but I did want to slide and, and slightly make sure y'all be on the uh, lookout for my boy Merlo. Next op up is Dre Dennis. Maybe top flow loop. I'm going to keep it 100. But I wasn't really supposed to say that, but I'm on some shit right now. We on the run. My boy Merlo is working. Y'all can talk all the shit y'all want. We back, in, we back in our bag. And after this, what they say, Polo, the price is going to fuck up. Now, now, um, real quick, uh, I want to. Two cars got announced today. Oh uh, well, this got announced too. Um, the Monopoly two car. I ain't gonna lie, Loso. Loso is battling. Sat. He's headlining Saturday and Sunday. You said what? Loso is headlining Saturday and Sunday. He is battling. I think he's battling back to back. He battling Tay Rock. Versus low, um, he's battling Geechee. Wait, hold on. Let me just get the full card real quick. Let me get the full card real quick, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Definitely on. smoking that BCM pack. And make sure y'all tune in. My boy Merlo had one of the same type of logo. He had the black joint on, hoodie joint on, the earn your metals joint. Listen, we're going to have Puff Prince. We, listen, bro, we on our shit. Be no Henry Mama, like I said. All my people that got, they coming, bro. Trust me, we appreciate all y'all support. And too, Polo, while you getting that together, listen, starting tomorrow, I got a raffle for everybody here, bro. I got a raffle for 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 a 50 to 60 inch TV and an Xbox S, the white one. I'm doing a $20 per ticket raffle. 14 days up to April 14th, we're giving away a 50 to 60 inch and the Xbox S, man. All we ask is a fundraiser for my AAU team. We need new shit. These events, two to three hundred per weekend. Look them up, bro. If you got an AAU team, you know how this shit going. I'm doing this shit all out of pocket and from the help from you people. We doing a TV Xbox giveaway April 14th. The flyer will be out. I need everybody to purchase at least one ticket. $20 per ticket, bro. Just one ticket. Two items. We're going to put your name on your shit, send you your raffle ticket, and we're going to do the live raffling and who win the TV and the Xbox. Stop the cap. Hit the cash out. We're going to get you right real That's soon. Fire. That's tomorrow, bro. But we need your support. My shorties, y'all know we traveling to different cities and all this. I just started my nonprofit. We ain't got our grants and all that rolling. I'm doing this all out of pocket, bro. And from the help of, of y'all, bro, be a part of something great. Earn your medals. FBF Elite, man. Friends, brothers, family. We putting these shorties on the path to be together and showing them different things, man. Support your boy, but it's coming tomorrow. Fly up, be out. Y'all know the boy working for these shorties, man. It's about to now. We here, yes, sir. Now we here. I got, I got it. So, okay, so the bullpen card is Friday, and and then the um the Geechee card is Sunday. So he's battling them on the same weekend. So the bullpen card just got announced. Politics as usual. We got Gwitty versus Super Black. We got T Top versus Chef Trash, New Jersey Twerk versus Clone, Tay Rock versus Loso, Bad News Awesome, John John Calico. That's going down on Friday. And then on Sunday, we got Monopoly 2. We got L. Ida Mayor versus D. Ida Henny Man. We got Franchise versus Eunice. Oh, Eunice, you dying. We got Chef Trash versus Billy Boondocks, Ad versus Don Marino, Shotgun Shook versus Capo. Riggs versus Snake Eyes, Geechee versus Loso, and Tay Rock versus A Ward. I ain't gonna lie, that's crazy. That's a crazy one. Okay, get it to it. Get to the first one. You, what's up? What's now, I, um, the, the John John call being that it's at the. I don't really want to give predictions. I give quick predictions. Me and got to jump into the um the whole breakdown of it because we that, that's like the end of the month. But um, Gwitty Super Black Cool Battle, T Top Chef Trez Cool Battle. Twerk clone has the potential to be crazy, but I don't know what twerk I'm getting this year. I'm being honest. Uh, Tay Rock versus Loso. Now, this is what I want to talk about. Loso is battling Tay Rock on Friday, and he battling Geechee on Sunday. Is he bugging? What was Loso last battle? He just he did just, a two on two. He just battled. He just did a one on one too. What was Loso last battle chat? Um, 
He did the two on two with with uh with A War when he battled. Did he Matt battle Myron. Myron? Oh, that was two on two. And then official, he just battled official at the uh the U Dub. He just died on that. Official just cooked him, right? Yeah. He, you he me, yeah, I ain't gonna lie, man. Now you telling me you think he finna salsa, you think he finna salsa through Tay Rock and Gucci in two days back to back. Now the shit sound good. I took Gucci and Tay Rock back to back, but if they kick your ass, yo, is you trying to? Is, like, is, is you is is you trying to end your career? Like what? I don't understand the strategy behind this. Are you retiring? Like, is you trying to be in a hospital for the rest of the year, my boy? You done? You done, Loso? Just let us know. You let done? It, like, is, let us know if you done. You could just say you if done. You, you done, ain't got to do no crazy shit. You ain't got to do this. Like, I don't know, Loso, man. Did First not off, be no official. No, he didn't. Hell, no official. Official went crazy on him. No, he didn't. Rock ain't battling too much. Rock, listen, Rock ain't took a drop off. Besides them arguing in between the battles, that's the most you can say Koreans. When them rap start coming out, that brother is wilding. He is clearly the front runner for 2024 champion of the year. Clear at this moment. It ain't no motherfucker close. Yeah. It ain't even, it's one space, 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 two, three, four, five. Like it ain't even a close two. The boy is one, regularly doing what he do. We not going to do that. I ain't going to lie, y'all. If Loso lose, because he already lost the official to me. If he lose to Tay Rock and Geechee, there's no way he should even make it near top 15 list. How? If he died on all three of these, because I thought he died the uh, official. I ain't going to lie to you. I thought she murdered him. Hold on. Top 15? The nigga might not even be alive after this weekend. Nah, you... Nah, you know how you know how you know how some of these you know how the panel might get. You know they like these. You know bro, they, you know what I mean. Might not, bro. That nigga may not be alive during that weekend. Now listen, but let's keep it a hundred. Let's get Loso some credit. He got a chance to do some phenomenal things. We got we got, we gonna keep it fair because people always say, "Oh, y'all like to do." He got it now. If huh? he going, now if he going there some way and somehow, we gotta put it. We gotta play devil's advocate. I learned this from you. We gotta play devil's advocate. If he's some way somehow going there and can be make these classic battles of fuck around and win, what did this put low so that he could just clip Tay Rock and Geechee in a two day span? That's crazy, Polo. Yeah, listen, he ain't beating Geechee. Uh, off rip, I like I know he ain't beating Geechee. Geechee. So said, yeah, you supposed to say he you know he ain't beating Tay Rock. No, 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 no. This is what I'm saying. He ain't being either one of them. Them two killers, like you, them two people, you gotta take months apart from each other. Like nigga, you ain't that, you ain't that fire to be taking them niggas on a Friday and Sunday. Honestly, they should feel disrespected. To be honest with you, they should feel disrespected. You ain't you, you take you battling Tay Rock on Friday and Geechee on a Sunday. Like nigga, is you crazy? Gotta be. Like, and it's, I don't know, man. Yeah, you got a hell of a manager, but uh, I, I don't, I don't really know. That one is kind of, that one is kind of crazy. Um, Arsenal versus Bad News. Yeah, I got bad news. You already know what Arsenal gonna do. You're like, yeah, we know. Salute. We know what Arsenal gonna do. John, John Calico. I feel like they best friends, so I don't really know about how I feel about this battle. I feel like John John and Calico is mad cool, man. I don't know. That's like maybe I'm bugging. So I, I gotta really I gotta see how the promo gonna be, man. Um now a lot of mayor Henny Man. That's a mirror match. Like they both kind of got like the same kind of style. That's a mirror match to me, kind of just uh like that. That's gonna be interesting. Units versus franchise. I'm telling y'all right now, y'all niggas must have forgot who franchise is. Listen. Don't let the fact that this border, the border fooled y'all, and it was COVID, and y'all know how Toronto, Canada was when COVID came. They act like America was some walking dead zombie land. So my thing with this, Eunice ain't never faced a nigga that's going to be barking on him like this. Like, And to be honest with you, franchise is wild lyrical. So it's like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know, like, yo, Eunice believability is not gonna sound good versus franchise. So I like respectfully. I got he gonna have to show me. You know, I'm gonna show me. Eunice can do that Taliban on. I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Taliban Eunice is here. 
franchise better be in a bendo. Man, and all you that see franchise, what franchise just did the Arsenal. You see what he just did the Arsenal. Everybody doing anything to Arsenal. Nah, not like Man, that. Arsenal get anything done to him right now. After that 303 where he no blacked pity. out and that one battle before that with him and B-Magic, after that, anything has happened to Arsenal. Arsenal's just on stage. The nigga choked at his own event. Then he showed up and battled himself and said nothing. Like Franchise not like, playing with this that boy, nigga boy. Arsenal doing anything. All I'm saying is that if Franchise coming in and think it's going to be sweet with that young nigga Eunice, his ass going to be in trouble. On my baby, he's going to be in trouble. Y'all ass crazy in the motherfucker. Arsenal been just losing to anybody. Eunice going to be in there ready to when fight. Do you see and Fran- I when do you see he's Franchise ever that Taliban be- out? Franchise don't be getting cooked battle. like that. that Taliban on, it's nigga. a real matchup. This is yeah. where you got yourself a real matchup now. You ain't got yeah. somebody that's looking Another, at, yeah, like, and French, has, and French has got a nigga that's young and hungry that's not coming looking French at look at franchise young and hungry. Nigga, he ain't old. I'm saying so. I expect of nothing but a fight, nigga. Franchise, you know, what have the, no easy yo, night. Yo, he's pulling up on that bando talk, man. Stop Taliban. playing, with, man. Listen, bro, the bando ain't Stop playing with Crody listen, like that. You listen, know, how them, you know, how them Canadians do not playing with Crody like that. Listen, that nigga ain't never been to Morocco. My nigga, my nigga got a passport too. Eunice been in Morocco, nigga. Fuck you talking about with them people. Eunice don't, don't get no pussy, though. Yeah, faithful. That means he got discipline. Yeah. Now, he ain't just bought in about, it, about what's going on around him because everybody fucking. He ain't that ready. Mean he, he, he don't ready when he ready. Nah, boy. Nigga, I like getting it, pussy. That boy got a lot of built-up energy. He got yeah, a lot nigga, of built-up energy. Man, you know what happened? Happened, happened? Getting pussy had me having kids early. Had to leave college to come back and take care of them kids and all type of shit. You yeah, because you, you was raw dogging. All, all that shit sound cool, Eunice. Live your life, man. Do this shit the righteous way. You got discipline. Franchise cooking this nigga. Trick, y'all. Some of these niggas just thought he got that boy got a up. lot of built up frustration, man. Fred, yo, franchise, hey, hey, Eunice, don't, hey, Eunice, don't let these boys trick you. I've been fucking since been fucking. But a lot of these niggas just thought Rhyme- getting pussy. <laughs> A lot of these Listen. niggas just start getting pussy, Yunus. So when they tell you you're a virgin, don't even trust. <laughs> a lot of these niggas just start getting pussy. Listen, Yunus, you talking to uh, I, I, yeah, I don't know, but all I'm saying is franchise ain't playing with him. He got him. He got him. He got him. He Yunus got a person like I feel like when Miss Hustle, Miss Hustle was doing him a favor. I feel like. She felt like she was doing him a favor. She even rapped it. She even said, I'm doing this favor for you. Woop, woop, woop. And Man, we found out what happened after. Franchise much, ain't doing him no favor. He looking at him like competition. He was not playing with her ass. I love Miss Hustle, too. But that was a good battle. And, hey, listen, you better look up because that shit can affect what's going on in a couple of days. What just happened this weekend, they say. When the motherfucker Wody supposed to be announced tomorrow, right? She better be uh, careful. Yeah, we gonna get, that was a perfect segue, too. Real quick. Yeah, yeah, that, that, yeah, she better be careful. Because that could be one of the battles that run the doorbell. Um, Ad, Ad versus Don Marino. You know oh, I got right. Ad. Don Marino, salute. Salute, my salute. What card that's on? That's on the riot. Salute, Vato. But Vato, listen, hey, Vato. Geechee. Hell no. You ain't getting that shit. You, hey. you, hey, salute. You got a free vacation, man. You got a free trip to Atlanta. Enjoy yourself. Hey, Enjoy Geechee. the scenery. Hey, Geechee. I love you to death. And and get I, I, maybe you just wanted to give your brother I have some money. Hey Don Marino, run the league, put the Florida Radians on, and sit back. <laughs> sit, over with. sit back, Don. Hey Don, you had your height, DNA had you on fight. He showed you the ropes of how to manage, put people in position. Stop this shit, man. I have finna cook you. And then you should just manage from here on out. Put put the Florida movement in place. They doing they one two. And that's it. And that's all, Nate. Oh, they battling in Florida, so uh, it ain't a free vacation. Hey, just enjoy the bread then. Um, shotgun shook versus Capo. Capo. I got. Me, I don't know, man. That's a tough another one. Another one. You got a Capo. You need <laughs> one of those performances. You need a snap performance. Is you winning battles against top tiers? Yeah, you is, and maybe so to a lot of people. Some you lose. But you need one of the performances of, damn, you seen what Capo did to Suge? But we need you to battle a good Suge, because Suge, you as well. You ain't been doing a lot of shit lately, Suge. I'm going to keep it a bean with you. Taking these battles, you having one good battle here, two okay battles there. No, Suge. 
You got to get back in that fucking bag when you was chasing that Cody, bro. And after that Cody year, they ain't put you top five. You just been showing up. I'm being honest with you. I'm back on y'all ass. The big speaker is fucking back, Polo. I'm not letting these niggas bullshit. Y'all want the energy back? Y'all need the niggas that's letting these niggas know they're not doing a fucking Facts. job. Facts. The energy is back. been doing a fucking job, G. Get back on your motherfucking shit, bro. Because beating him right now, Capo, don't really do you no service. His still game been doing too much of nothing. He promoting his movies, which is dynamic. Dope music, but he ain't battle-wise. He ain't been doing what he yeah. needs to do. Shug trying to be George Foreman, man. Shug, hey, get man. back to being Shug. He cooking chicken wings. He making barbecue <laughs> sauce. <laughs> yo, get, yo, get back to pocket tapping these niggas, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> so that nigga making chicken wings and barbecue sauce that like, he fucked out of here. That nigga ain't trying that nigga, to rap. That nigga ain't trying to rap. No, he get that barbecue money, that man. Making uh, barbecue sauce, bro, and chicken wings. What's the name of sauce? How you? <laughs> um, uh, I gotta, I gotta check it out. I'm gonna check. I gotta check it out. I'm looking to pull it up now. Straight. Let's get one way. So <laughs> <that shit. laughs> oh, Polo, stop speed. Slow down, Polo. Yo, you making me laugh. Let's nigga. get one wing straight. That nigga selling barbecue straws and wings and rib tips. So you need a good battle, nigga. Fuck out of here. We back. We not get. We not letting up on nobody. Tone, bro, Polo. We on these <laughs> niggas' neck. Battle rap. You know what? Y'all, y'all know what that happened. Y'all know what the fuck that happened? Let me get my shit off. Let me let me take my last. Oh, let me get my shit off. Y'all know what happened? You motherfucking blogs. All y'all niggas try to take compromise and this and this and that. You niggas done got so cool with these niggas, y'all didn't let up. That's why these battles and this is fire. That's why this shit ain't going. Because all you niggas uh -huh. are patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Uh -huh. Y'all trying to act like y'all ain't biased, but y'all don't fuck with this battle rap, but y'all patting this battle rap on the back at the back. That's why these battles is not as competitive. Y'all let these niggas go on face offs, give y'all whatever, because y'all being friends. But y'all was calling us compromise when Battle Rap was most lit. When Battle Rap was most lit, Surf was here doing a one two, it was lit. Now you niggas is friends. Y'all all in the spaces talking with these niggas. This shit then got friendly. Let's get to who really compromised. You niggas not doing y'all fucking jobs. Uh -huh. That's it. You niggas try they to get not. a new wave of talent. You niggas not doing y'all fucking jobs and let these niggas know this shit not up to standards. Ah. Y'all sitting under these niggas in spaces and letting them act like, yeah, true, true, true. No, it's not true. It's you not true. Lie. And that's they ain't been true for hours. Whatever. Because you niggas coming there after a battle and letting niggas parade around like it just was a movie and the shit was okay. Fuck out of here, nigga. I'm back. The big speaker on this shit. That's why y'all need me. As much as y'all saying, nigga, y'all know what battle rap was like? Because I was going against the niggas. I was telling niggas it wasn't that. I'm me and Verb going back and forth. Me and Geechee got an altercation. Me and Easy got it lit. I was in the algorithm. Y'all let all these fake space cadets get in the middle and, and, and not have this shit all live because they want to play friendly, friendly, and, and be at the shows and do hostess. And that's why it's fucked up. But I'm back. Nah. <laughs> yeah. Everybody want to be Jay Black now. Uh. Now, we got Riggs versus Snake Eyes. Whew, it's going to be a tough one. You know, hey, Tom, hey, Snake Eyes, you already owe some money. I'm being, man, fuck that. I'm back to the real. Polo, right now, I'm letting you know I'm back to the real shit. All this, whatever, nigga, you're going to be my friend, be my friend, nigga. But I'm lighting this shit up. Snake Eyes, you already lost the bet, nigga. You my man, 100 grand. Tom say he's standing on his artist side. So that face-off you did with hip-hop is real was phenomenal. But what, nigga, you already owe a little bit. So you already down 101. Tone say he's standing with the artists. He met Mama Love. Shout out Papa and them. Little nephew, TT and them. But I'm standing with my artists. Huh? What you gonna do, nigga? It's I ain't gonna lie, Snake Eyes. Your promo gotta match the bars. Like, you starting to... You starting to be all pro. I mean, I ain't gonna front. You coming to battle. You gotta win a you gotta clearly win a match. I feel like you be going to situations, 
You be you you be reacting to the crowd not reacting to you like yo you a bad guy snake eyes they not gonna like you wherever you go they not gonna like you it is what it is uh, get to the know, rap you know he's dropping that because of me it's because of me listen I'm gonna keep it a buck I'm I, the reason Tony is considered a bro hey battle He'll, academy hey this I seen y'all pardon self I know y'all sent the number through it, I mean no disrespect the big speaker I'm teaching the youth I got kids I'm doing a lot of things. But at the same time, send me that VOD. Because y'all was talking real heavy. And I ain't gonna lie. I ain't see the K Walker versus Snake Eyes. So I can't really speak on it. That weekend, I was very speak, uh, very busy. My team was at the Chicago League Invitational. Look it up. Very big tournament in the city. But from the clip, it looked like Snake Eyes was trying to wild K Walker up. See, I ain't see the battle in full, Polo. So I can't even really woof like I did. But from the clip. Wait, wait. I didn't even. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It looked like Snake Eyes. No, nah, no, nah, I'm saying, we, no, nah, I ain't finished with the um the car yet, the, okay, the riot it, car. It looked like Snake Eyes was getting bite. Yeah, I, that nigga can't walk. I ain't going to lie, because this is the, we might stand, we're we going to have to switch the fly up. Stand on business, we're going to stand on business on the radio show. But, um, because it's, 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 it's my other shit to get through real quick. Um, So, wait, real quick, so who you got, Riggs or Snake Eyes? I got Snake Eyes, nigga. What up, Tom? Yeah, I got Snake Eyes. Hey, Salute, Tom. Took death, nigga. Yeah, Merlo on the run, nigga. What death wanna do, Tom? And what, I got what, Merlo what, versus Def hey, too. What death wanna do, Tom? We wanna get a live battle, nigga. Merlo up. Dre Dennis, you next, nigga. Top floor, what up? Battle Academy, we coming to see you, niggas. We outside, nigga. Merlo 100. Nah. Next battle, Geechee Loso. I mean, we kind of went through this one. I got Geechee Loso. I ain't loud. I ain't gonna lie, Loso. Teddy Rock might put you in a hospital. Like, you might be showing up to the Geechee battle and, 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 and bondages and shit, nigga. Like, you you might be showing up getting pushed in a wheelchair. Like, you might not be able to... I, I don't know. I don't know how, what the condition Tay Rock gonna leave you with. Pause. No ditty. Um, I got Geechee. Tay Rock versus A Ward. Real... How you calling that one? What you mean, nigga? You know who Award. I got. I ain't got no motherfucker. Hey, what? Call it what you want. I got Tate Rock telling niggas show me they can be him. I ain't got. Listen, bro. I'm letting y'all know fucking right now. Tate Rock versus anybody. I have Tate Rock going into the battle. Until you beat him and I break it down and can say you beat the nigga, I don't have you. The fuck? This is a 20 year fucking vet, man. This a nigga been beating ass since beating ass and never stopped. You know how niggas say he been battling since the beginning? How y'all was giving T Rex and all these niggas. Tay Rock is one of those T Rex. He's the new generation T Rex. All errors. Yeah, for this one, I got somebody said Polo. Who you got? Listen, man, I got Tay Rock. I had Tay Rock the minute this battle was announced. Um, I, is A War gonna be good? Sure, but when it really come down to it, the shit Tay Rock could rap about in the places like the the level Tay Rock could go with the shit he could rap about, I just think A War can't go to that level. Um, bro, I, I think when it comes to these type battles, a Tay Rock type nigga. I don't have Tay Rock going into no battle, losing to no nigga until they beat him. So from here on out, for the rest of Tay Rock career, when you say Tay Rock versus who, just know I got Tay Rock going into the battle. I don't give a fuck if he lost six battles. I don't give a fuck if he lost seven. He didn't earn that seniority at this point that his name is fucking Tay Rock, bro. Who whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Who gonna beat Tay Rock? That don't make no sense. Wait a minute, Tay Rock is battling on Friday versus Loso. So he batted Loso on Friday and A Ward on Sunday. And the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Loso I, I don't know. That's kind of crazy. Yo, what is going on? Listen, he battling two Christians. You could put their careers together, and it don't add up to his. He didn't rap more than them. Why is everybody battling on the same weekend? What the hell is going on? He didn't rap more than them niggas together. They can put their careers together and Tay Rock can rap more than both of them. Is URL going? They in Florida. Is URL going? You think URL going to pop out April 27th? Make it a whole battle rap weekend? You think who? URL going to pop out April 27th? That Saturday think, open. I think, I think the game is one of those days, you know, because they're doing an MS. Uh, MPS3, oh, okay. Uh, tournament shit down on the same weekend, you know. Shout out. Oh, nah. Chef Trez on both cards, too. These niggas that can do that, though, bro. Listen, bro. All this, listen, bro. These niggas that we name 
it's not no, I just got on my bike and started biking. If niggas can't do two battles in the weekend at this point, Polo, and, and, and I ain't saying be dynamic, but be very good, niggas ain't professional at this point. Niggas ain't professional. Yo, no, that's hey, a lot of different hey, niggas battling. Hey, Polo, hey, Polo, you one of the coldest niggas. If I say Polo, I got an event on, a, on, I got three events for some top notch shit. I need you to come and bring them people through. Every other day, you gonna have your people ready and that shit gonna be done. You polo, nigga. Fuck you talking about. You accept this shit up. I'm going three events. Oh, what they got? 5,000 for me? I mean, that's true, too. Come on, bro. A professional is a professional. I catered, I catered my own baby shower. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, polo. hey polo. I catered all kind of shit. Hey, hey, uh -huh. hey, Polo. When Mike Tyson started knocking motherfuckers out, was he waiting? Was he waiting? He was knocking motherfuckers out every other week. It's when just Floyd, that's a lot of in it. That's like when, a listen, lot of interchanging. Listen when, well, listen, when Floyd Mayweather got on his run, he was whooping niggas there three months, Polo. He wasn't even waiting six. The boy was outside for the 10 to 20 bands there three, there six, there three months. If you, John, John, you couldn't wait that, tomato. These niggas, bro, these niggas can't tell us they professionals if they ain't doing this shit. NBA players got to play 82 games and they playing every other day, every two days, Polo. If you like that, you like that at this point. All this shit, you don't tell me you top tier, it takes a standard to be top tier, and this is where we at right now. All that other shit niggas doing, oh, back-to-back, -back, be good, nigga. Wait, Great Calico battle, easy. Cal Calico battle the weekend before that one? On his card? Calico battle on his card. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, Nick. God damn. <laughs> now, you mentioned something earlier I want to get into. You said hustle with the Eunice Wody. Wody, I believe, is either tomorrow or 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 Tuesday. I think it's Tuesday though, because tomorrow I think everybody in the world gonna be watching. Yeah, it's like a holiday or something. You know, all the kids out. But I got, hey, I got a scrim. Hey, I, don't worry about it. Go ahead. Yeah. So now, um, yeah. So Wody is, I believe, Wody is Tuesday. So who do you, in your opinion, who do you think is gonna get the Wody? Bro, in my opinion, I just think it, it, it just fucks battle rap up. Now, two things can happen. It's dope. It will be dope if Jazz was to become the first back-to-back -back female Wody. But I feel like in Jazz faith, how could you be the Wody when you ain't empower shit for the women but yourself? You ain't battle another woman. <laughs> I'm just keeping it real. How y'all listen? In my opinion, bro. I love Jazz to death. And she just won one. I think she won that one by her. I think Hustle could have been argued to have won that one. I'm saying within that favor, you didn't battle another woman. So how much of female battle rap did you uplift or did you just really uplift yourself? Oh, she battled RX. We didn't even see it. It was a mixed thinker with Fry. They tried to put it out. Nobody gave a fuck. Because when they put it out, it was so far beyond the battle. Who gave a fuck? King Ba was a whole joke that came and made a mockery of that shit. That shit wipe. Let's stop fucking playing. That girl, Miss Hustle, came out at the top of the year and battled my verse, who everybody didn't want to battle, and my verse acted like it was a threat. Smoked her. She cooked a shuni that was on fire that everybody forget at the Chrome anniversary. Big car. She also was the only woman... On a lot of these mail cards, solo fucking dolo. Mm. So not only did she battle the women and power those on female cards, she battled the males. Not only old the males, she battled newer males. The she's the youngest, but she also battled the Tay Rock Force 50th. Now, Coffee also got a, a debate. Because she also another woman that did great and went outside the country. But I feel like with Miss Hustle following up the year she just had with being so close to Jazz in that year and coming right back at the top of the year. Because right after Jazz won that, Miss Hustle came out the top of that year, clearly for the first four months, clearly the woman. So I just can't dispel that because Jazz made a battle some males with high names. When, like I say, I feel like Hustle did this shit at a high rate. No chokes, no slips, no friendly uh, fiestas. The whole nine, I think Hustle deserved it. And it just set the barrier and make it more clearer. And no, me and Hustle ain't got nothing going on. I just feel like a Vixen won one, Coffee won one. When I feel like one of them years, I ain't gonna say no, I feel like Casey J was robbed out of one. But that's another story. I ain't mad at who won. Jazz got one. I just feel like Hustle getting one makes it better even more for the for the female, for females in battle rock. And I think she deserved it. How come 
okay, I ain't gonna find I was good. How come Jazz is winning on all the polls though? Like, I like, how come it's because, like because, bro, again, bro, it's like polo, it's like knowing a motherfucker. If you don't really know hustle, hustle, let's keep it honest. She give off this disgusting ass uh personality will will make people and she'll curse you the fuck out over the littlest things. That's gonna make people automatically be against you. Jazz got this poster child, lovely battle rap sweetheart attitude where everybody just love jazz. Tomato tomorrow. It's not it's not hard, bro. It's gonna be you versus just because because I know one thing. If I can't hurt you mentally through what I say, I know one thing. I can spiritually hate. Do jazz to uplift her more than you because I know one thing you're gonna be mad about is us having jazz over you. Let's be honest, bro. Like, and, motherfuckers and, gonna act like it's crazy. And the motherfuckers don't like hustle because of, uh, of her attitude when it comes to work ethic, bars, performances, all that. And again, jazz choked last year. Let's keep it honey. We had never seen that from someone that's supposed to be up here. Tay Watch 313. Let me see this. He says, hold up. Okay, he says Jazz won Wody all wo uh, all women last year, and y'all said she need to battle more men. Now she battle more men. Y'all said she need more women. We never said no. She need to I never more said men. no. The coaches said she need to battle more men. I never said she need to battle more men. That's one because again, in in Jazz the rapper favor, I seen Jazz the rapper. Coffee had been gone. Coffee come back on fire. I seen Jazz the rapper at a Queen of the Ring event say live. When 40 didn't show up, if 40 don't want to battle coffee, I'll take her live. This is what she said to the people. Also, we see her hustle going back and forth. Her hustle also was the top one and two coming into this year. The well coming into last year. That's matches that's gotta happen. Just like y'all made Geechee battle shine before that. Just like y'all made see uh Killer Jones and Shine battle even after the year was up. These type of things got to matter when you coming into the year. You don't get to have a one and two women, but you get to go battle all the males, and you don't come and line up with this rematch when y'all had Geechee uh, battle a war twice. Geechee battle run nitty a couple of times. Different rematches that went on. That's one of the biggest matches in female battle rap, which could have been on the Summer Madness, which Hustle told y'all. Jazz didn't take that. She took another male when three of them, let's be honest, was friendly as fuck. Y'all all felt like that, and we all felt like that. They was cool battles, but it wasn't no, she might die, this, this, and that. When Hustle Battles came, my verse, Shumi, she, Tay Rock, all these battles, it's, he finna kill his bitch, or she might she might lose. The pressure was even different, and that matters. Hmm. Salute. So we got about, between all, all the platforms we streaming on, we got and about 1,600. Honest, her. BK. Got about 1600 in here. Salute. I just want to say that. Hit the like. Salute. That. Thank you, everybody. BK, watching BK, us and stuff BK. like that. Share the stream. Now, this is my thing, though. My thing, it, it could be two arguments that could be made kind of for both that's going to make this debate kind of crazy because um, Jazz names on her resume is just kind of crazy. She battled Big K. She battled... Um, she, uh, she, uh, hold on. Let me just pull up her resume real quick. She battled Rum Nitty. She battled Twerk. Her resume is kind of crazy. And it ain't, it ain't about the resume, though. It's about the showings. Rich Dollars had yeah, a great resume. Yeah, but the resume, Rich Dollars had a great one resume. Of the cat, one Rich of the Dollars had a great resume. And he's an example. One of the, well, strong, he just, he just, he, he just, that's all you know him for. That's it. Yeah, but my thing is that's one of the categories. So what happens if it comes down to that category? And that like that small thing could push her over Miss Hustle. Well, in terms but I, of feel, I, I feel even with the resume, with the opponents that Hustle had, Hustle treated everybody she battled like a top tier opponent, though, and she gave top tier performances. You even yourself said Jazz had some friendly, friend, some friendlies. That's what they call soccer matches, not exhibitions. I'm just playing friendly. devil's advocate. You know, so I got even gotta... with devil's advocate. We fucked the devil's advocate at that point. You being a bar guy, how many friendlies you think Jazz had? Let's get to that. Let's get to the real. Um, I thought she she I thought she was cooking versus work. I, I like that battle. I thought she was cooking versus twerk. I thought the clips battle. She battled clips, if I'm not mistaken, right? Was it? I'm sorry. Uh, she battled Big K. Who was the third person? Rum Nitty. The Rum Nitty battle. I thought Rum Nitty took it kind of light on her. I ain't gonna lie. I think Clips was in there. Clips was in there, right? Clips ain't been putting out with number one. Me stinkers and fries. When the hell are they back? Uh, uh, that battle. Eh. 
I don't, let me pull up her resume. Let me let me do the right because we only got a got about sixteen hundred in here. Let me let me you know what I mean. Let me let me just pull she up her resume. Chest, correct. She got a chest too. Hell yeah. No, Hold listen. On. Are you talking about hustle? Listen. No, I'm talking about jazz. I'm talking about them asking me in the comments. Cause no. Okay, part of so. I don't like what Chess did, but I thought hustle was cooking that nigga. Hustle beat that nigga through Tallahassee, Miami, Dade County, back up to Naples, down in Tampa, Orlando. She was whipping on Chess. Fuck you, talking about. Um, okay, so Jazz resume is Charlie Clips, Rx, Loso, Rum Nitty, Twerk, Big K. Now let's keep it a hundred. Charlie Clips was what? That was that I don't even remember that battle. Rx was what? She cooked Rx. She cooked on where? How? Wait, it's on YouTube. That shit didn't even make no noise. <laughs> those those are two, they, they didn't promote it, but it's on YouTube. Bro, those are two friendlies off the Richter. Let's call it what it is. Brooklyn. Are Rex a friendly? No, the platform it was on and how that event was shot. It wasn't their fault, but that King by event was a fucking. We barely even seen the battle when it happened on the stream and all that. And then with Jazz, who had the rights of the battle, took forever and, and, and forever my lady to even drop the battle. That shit had no impact or nothing of nothing. So I thought it was common thing. knowledge that the battle was on YouTube. I didn't bro, know that niggas ain't know that. Bro, that is, they, oh, that's on two after the gate. What was the next battle? <laughs> Loso. This is where she, she, she cooked Loso. That was a one-rounder, right? Cooked them. One-rounder. Cool. Cooked okay. Them. What was the next battle? Rum Nitty. She won that. Cool I battle. thought Rum Nitty was a little friendly that battle. I ain't gonna lie, it wasn't really the Rum Nitty I'm used to, but I gave it a jazz. Okay, cool. What was the next battle? <laughs> Yo, y'all out of pocket in the comments. I ain't say nothing about the views. I ain't know. I ain't know about the views. Um, <laughs> about they views. Uh, new uh New Jersey twerk. I thought she I, got crazy. The scroll. I thought she got crazy with the scroll, but everybody act like it was a friendly, not me. I, I don't get how the people thought, because to me, I thought she, she got, was, I thought she beat twerk. I'm with you. Badly. On, fire, uh, on fire twerk, I think that's her most impactful shit on her schedule, period. And twerk just finished number two on Cody, though. That's how I'm with you. That's her most impactful shit on the schedule, period. And after that, she ran into Big K. Big K put foot and boot on her. And he, for, and he won listen, and he won it. So he it had to he had to have beat her to have win Cody. He won it. Elbows on him. Right? Now go through hustles. Okay, now let me get the hustles. Let me get the hustles. Let me get the hustles real quick. Pardon yourself. Hey yo, Jazz and Jazz and, oh, we don't follow us. Bro, this and even in that twerk battle. I seen Twerk pick, he picking Jazz up like a little sister spinning her around. They was acting like, look at them, they was acting like Will Smith and Hillary. Get the fuck out of here. They was acting like Will Smith and yeah. You thought they was brother and sister. Niggas, okay, now we get to Miss Hustle. Miss Hustle, and also after I want to I want to salute them too. Uh, Miss Hustle, her resume, my verse. Hook Shuni. my verse. My verse is doing all this. Cook my verse. Yeah, she yeah, she did cook my Remember, verse. She my verse come off the they ain't paying me. I'm top tier. All this all y'all was hey, they need to get my verse. She cooked my verse. Okay, okay. So okay, my verse. I'll give you that. I get uh she definitely was did. She, Shuni, the headline? She, she cooked Shuni. Was that the head? Was she the headline of that? Yeah, you, you hustle always gonna be the headline. Most okay. Now she come let's not forget because that was the headline on us too. This would get this would get lost. This would get lost. She won the hell out of that RX and uh that RX card with her RX. Her clips were no motherfucking headline either. Hustle and Arsenal wasn't the headline. Who the fuck was? Yo, get the fuck out of Cause, here. Because listen, because I know one thing was listen, one clips it, one clips of jazz on Kings and Queens. Yeah, yeah. Who headlined that? Who headlined that? I think they both kind of. I, I don't think it was. A, oh, I don't think they both kind of did. Polo, you I think they both kind of did, man. Brooklyn shit, nigga. You on huh? some Brooklyn shit, nigga. 
You want nah. some Brooklyn shit. You want some Brooklyn shit. Let's get to the facts, man. We own the facts. I'm being honest. I I, I think they both headline. I think it will. Whoever starts that headline debate will be debating for hours. They so both headline. Me, so you telling me Tay Rock versus Hustle wasn't the headline of Eclipse and Jazz? Yeah, that was the headline. Okay, let's move it along. That's but I also going. think Jazz and Clips, because Cole think what? Clips, is, Clips is a headline in his name Clips in itself. Clips been doing nothing, man. It don't matter. He gets booked for his name. Headline. The headline, he it's booked. only one headline, Apollo. Nah, I think in that situation oh, it, was, it could be ever. Nah, man, to, we it can't just be one. Stop, it's not bro. always. Well, hold up, hold up. It's not always one headline for all cards. It's not. It's not always that. We ain't doing that. Sometimes it's co headlines. I don't really. I'm not. I don't really subscribe to just one headline. I don't like. I don't really subscribe to just one. Man, headline. you lost your motherfucking mind, Paul. Okay, now let's go to the next one. Shuni Tay Rock. Uh, uh Tay, uh, Tay Rock. How'd you add? That was a debatable. I gave it a hustle though. That was a fight. I gave it a hustle personally. At the fifty of one, that, if if it wasn't for that battle, or maybe one more battle, that battle was ass. And, and Zaz played part in that on that card with clips. Nigga I'm said clips saying. that Mexican. Nigga said clips that Mexican Reggie. <laughs> oh my soul, that shit light work. Clips <laughs> ain't been nothing of nothing. So don't first think. Of, so think about it. That hustle is up her first three on jazz clear. My verse shooting Tay Rock is out the gate better than Clips RX for sure. What you got, Rum Nitty? Nah, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna do a side by side. I'm I'm, 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 I'm gonna do a side by side so the people can see. I'm gonna side do a side by, by side, side nigga. Hold on, let me let me get this side by side right. I'm gonna put first this side by two fourth and Jazz lost her fourth quarter game. Hold up. Hustle cooked Arsenal in December. Jazz lost to Big K in December. Because there's no fucking way y'all finna tell me Jazz beat Big K and he won Wody. I mean, he won Cody. Fuck out of here. Ain't okay, no okay, way. Okay, okay, Ain't okay. Ain't no way, so, bro. Ain't no way. Okay, okay. Now we here. But the only thing only thing is, okay, we, 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 we now, salute to everybody in here. We got a 1,000 on YouTube. We got about a 1,000 on Twitter. So we got like 2,000 no in here right now uh, all together on all platforms. So make sure you hit the like. Share this stream out the bar, guys. So we talking hip-hop. We talking battle rap. We talking, you know what I mean, what you need to be known about. So definitely make sure. I'm back. I'm ready. Cola, when you come back, I, I got the resumes. They ready to go. Um. Also... Real quick, I want to say radio show this week, a hundred percent this week. We back, uh, we back again. The ball guy show also is gonna be back this Tuesday. We we gonna do a bunch of shows this week and stuff. So we we got a lot of shit planning. Now I'm reading the resumes. Jazz for the people that's pulling up right now. We comparing Jazz the rapper and Miss Hustle resume. I'm gonna pull coffee up too. I'm gonna pull I'm gonna pull coffee resume up too. We ain't just gonna leave coffee out of this. Like it's just a clear. Let's go. Let's go, nigga. I had to get a. I had to get a yeah. Let's go. I'm here. I'm here. Yeah. Now, yeah. now, Jazz the rapper resume. Jazz the rapper again. Go she had one. Charlie. Go Clips. game one. Go game one. What's what's Jazz game All right, one? Jazz the Jazz the rapper Charlie Clips. Miss Hustle my verse. Who you going? Miss Hustle cooked my verse. Off the rip, the Jazz had a mixed thinker with fries with clips. She could have jumped in his chest and gave him a hug. Hmm. <laughs> she could have jumped, jumped in his chest and gave him a hug. That's how friendly that was. Hustle up 1-0. Okay. Hustle up 1-0. Oh, hold up, man. Nigga about to make me throw something in the air. Hustle Wait, up that 1-0. Is... Okay. Now, well, hold, we up, got... hold up, hold up, hold up. Don't skip it. What was Kofi's first one? Let's, let's do them all three right now. That's the three motherfuckers. Let's do it right now. Jazz. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me get right. Let me get right, too, man. Hold on. Let me get right. We're going to get right. Hold on. Let's go. Get right. Okay. Roll up. Take your time. Yeah, we here. Yeah, yeah we're we going to get we right. Let me get on, We've been putting on movies anyway. This the bar, guys. Let me get right with you. We were already rolled. Let's bring the <laughs> resumes up. Hey, Tom. Get your ass in if you need be, nigga. Get yeah, in here, get in here. It's Liddy. It's, it's Liddy. Liddy. Get in here. Um, hold up. Hey, Let me find coffee. Yo, can hey. somebody 
I'm letting y'all know right now. Listen, this our new shit. This our new shit. If a fan make a co considerable donation to the bar guys, the cash out, you get to come on and debate with the bar guys. We ain't doing nothing. Make a considerable donation to the cash out. Whichever fan want to come up, if Tom come up, we're going to make four boxes and you get to join into this dope debate. We're going to put it out and all that. Support the brand. We support you. It all works. We got something new going. Hit Polo Cash out. BCM Polo. I want to come up and debate with y'all. No troll shit because whether you, 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 you donate or not, you get the troll or we kick you the fuck out of here. Let's get Shout out to Snoop Dogg, too, man. It's but Snoop at the Dogg, same time, Snoop Dogg Gelato is incredible. Keep going, Cola. At the same time, stop that cap with that cash out. Polo BCM. Hey, this the pull up. Come up here. But we're going to run through all three of their resumes, and I'm going to tell you what's going on. Okay. Okay. So, Hustle. Oh, uh, say how much? Nigga, stop that cap with the cash out. Highest bidder is up, nigga. <laughs> what are you talking about? Ass, no bullshit. Um... Coffee first battle was twerk. So she got foot the boot. Hustle yeah. up one zero. Okay, now hustle Shuni the rapper. Jazz next battle was RX and chat. I didn't hold up because I want the chat to participate in this too. The chat, y'all in charge of coffee resume. So y'all got to type in coffee resume. So Miss <laughs> Hustle is Shuni. Um, Jazz is RX. Hustle is up again, clearly. Hustle up again for sure, hundred percent. One of the best events, big events last year. Sony Music Hall, big stage, last battle of the night. She made an event at that as well, and Cook Shun Shun uh, on fire, Shuni. See, this is what niggas fail to forget. That was Shuni coming into that year on fire. Okay, now coffee next battle. Was Snake Eyes? Well, well, Snake Eyes is also in that one. So Jazz, I think Jazz got RX, Coffee got Snake Eyes, and Miss Hustle got Shuni. So who who you doing between Jazz RX battle or Coffee's uh Snake Eyes battle? You said between Jazz and and, and Coffee. Yeah, I got Coffee battle over that Jazz battle. <laughs> yeah. Because that's yeah, when we got the Snake Eyes. And, and Snake Eyes won as bad as niggas tried to make it seem. I'm going to keep it a bean. If niggas feel like Kofi won, I ain't mad at that. Because Kofi was on the... On they saying Kofi 30 him, but it was a McStinker. It wasn't really a, a, a crazy battle, but I thought Snake Eyes did better than niggas. Okay, Chad saying Kofi cooked him. But I still got Hustle over Sony at Sony Music Hall, which I was there. That may take into account. That's out, and she had to go after Hitman versus Easy. Oh, she had to go after that. She had to go perform after Hitman and Easy just blew the Easy just got Hitman out of here. Now imagine that, and she go up there and thirty Shuni another on fire. Hustle is up two zero. Mm, okay, okay, wow. All right, so she's all right. So now we got Tay Rock. We got Tay Rock and Jazz. Jazz has Loso. Now, as an event in the overall, that bullpen event was fire. That's the one we got the backlash from. We're going to keep it 55th Street. But let's keep it real. Tay Rock, 50th, Hustle, only female on the card. You are real. Let's keep it a fucking real. The girl got URL Chrome URL. So she, not only is she got three, two, she on the two of the biggest leagues at this point, and she the headline all three of them bitches. And she just got Tay Rock on his 50th. I got hustle again. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, but I this is the thing though. Well, who Kofi got? Kofi has a brother by the name of Grid. She thirded him though, but I don't know I who the hell that is. Anybody versus Tay Rock at that moment gonna be the biggest shit, man. Let's get, get let's stop fucking playing. It's Kofi versus I mean it's Hustle versus Tay Rock at his 50th. Now this Nick is where Jazz start. Hell. Now this is now this is this is where Jazz start cooking. Now I think Jazz did a strategic strategy, and you could tell by this schedule. I think Hustle's is top heavy and Jazz is bottom heavy. Um the next battle is twerk, and the next battle for her is Capo. 
kick Capo ass, but you got to give it to Jazz Twerk. Who called? Yeah, that Twerk. Okay. Um. And uh, OTFMZ salute y'all. I see y'all in the chat. They've been helping us out. Let's keep it make. We was, we gave. Let's keep it a hundred because this is what happened. We gave me and you. Yeah. Hey, hit man. I'm on bags and body. Yeah, Listen, I ain't gonna lie. That let's she, keep she it a fucking hundred now. now. It, it, even if it's a, it may be an edge slightly because again, me and you gave the nigga Capo and Spills a reality check talking about what Capo need to do. In these type of battles, he had just lost the blue cocaine. Hustle just went up there and wild him up in the one round. And, and like I said, now they both got one rounders on their resume. Loso had Jazz. I mean, uh, Jazz had Loso. Hustle had Capo. Loso, the bigger name. Jazz did phenomenal. So I got Jazz on that one. But at the same time, not by a lot. Because she cooked Capo. Niggas was asking Capo what he was going to do after that. Okay, now the last bat, the next battle, Coffee, Coffee had, had, had Geechee. Nah, yeah, but the Geechee, the Geechee yeah, Coffee had Geechee. But that wasn't, it. the Geechee one, I thought was, I thought the Jazz one happened a couple months before the, um, but. Just going in the line of what they went. Fuck when it happened. Who was okay, so Rum Nitty, so, okay, so the line of Coffee is around the Rum Nitty time. So Coffee battled Geechee around the Rum Nitty time. Not and great. I thought, and I thought, and I thought the only blemish damn near on Geechee resume in the year he had last year, top Cody nigga, was Kofi Brown. I thought Kofi Brown got Geechee. Whether he yeah, I, I definitely not. feel like Kofi was the reason he didn't win Cody again. I feel like that battle it was hard for people to really because Kofi Kofi got Geechee Gotti, bro. A good Geechee that year. I think that's the only battle you could probably say Geechee Gotti lost last year was Kofi fucking Brown. A grudge. Okay. She went in there so, it on 10, nigga. So okay, that so. Round, that round might fuck around. Go to Kofi, nigga. Okay, so nah, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, that rum nitty, that rum nitty jazz battle, and then and then she had Capo. And I might get that. I'm gonna Kofi. get Kofi, Jazz, and then Capo the last. Now, Eunice, Hustle had Eunice. Um, Jazz had Rookie BK. Had and and no and no, no, no 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 because what happened where you gonna put arsenal at jazz only hustle got more battles than arsenal okay that, okay let's make okay let's get to it cool. yeah yeah yeah. that's why i was yeah now, jazz big k. Now, now let's get the big k cool he won cody harder opponent let me let's not get it fucked up but jazz lost hustle went in there with units in my opinion won the battle and also even if you feeling like, if you feeling like they both lost, I ain't, a, I ain't, a, I ain't mad at that. But dude, the rookie of the year as well, which somehow didn't make top twenty. Cody, which I don't know how the fuck that double, that works. A nigga rookie of the year, but he don't make top twenty best battle rappers. I never heard of that, but that's another story. But at the same time, okay, you can get how could you get Jazz that in a battle? She lost. She lost. I ain't gonna lie, y'all gonna call me crazy. I had jazz that battle. I'm standing on that. I'm standing on business. Okay. I had jazz that battle. Cool. If you feel like, if you feel like Big K got uh for for devil's advocate, if you feel like Eunice got hustle, ain't no argument. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I don't think Eunice got hustle. I'm just saying for the fans. If you oh yeah. Like K, if you feeling like Big K got jazz and that's they one off, cool. But jazz, but even in that month of jazz having Big K. A couple of days prior to that, was the resume don't tell you because Jazz don't have as many battles as, as Hustle. Jazz when it lost, Hustle put foot to boot on Arsenal. Say what you want, she put foot to boot on him. Another car, she was the only female on. Okay, and um, real quick, I'm just upload. Okay, real. Okay, now, uh, coffee. Who's and Jazz coffee? choked that battle. I had Jazz that battle. I ain't gonna lie, Jazz. She, I wasn't that really... battle. she lost the shit out that battle, Paul. So, but the thing is now, the thing is, I ain't gonna front. And Strength Jazz, and schedule. Hustle battle KCJ. That's a fact on Netflix. One but month. it didn't come out though. It ain't dropped though. Everybody that's the only that's happened. the only reason I ain't say that. Everybody know what happened. That's the only reason I ain't say that. And then Everybody coffee battle Shuni. Coffee ended coffee battle Shuni lastly. I thought that, coffee beat, and I thought coffee beat. That too. was a cold battle. That was a cold battle. I just feel like I just feel like 
Kofi did good shit. It just wasn't impactful as hustle. I think hustle shit was more man. I think hustle and jazz shit was just more mainstream and hit hard. I'm not saying she ain't had big moments like her versus Shuni Queen of the Ring that was dope, but Queen of the Ring getting they fire back. Her going over to London doing a one two. I just feel like hustle did enough to to win, bro. Especially coming off last year back to back. Just like y'all, like just like the males do eight war. They act like because eight war was twenty, he deserved to be fired because he was twenty this year. Do my girl the same way. She did a one two, and last year she didn't lose because she just lost. I think Han Jazz was a flip of a coin. I don't think it's a flip of a coin this year. I think she, her resume and what she did is clearly better than what Jazz did. Now, do Jazz got the names? Yeah, but as far as the work, the names plus everything went in. I got hustle. Shuni vs. Kofi what was was on was on that queen was on that wasn't they on that card when you did the pay per view all and listen Josh huh? and even with that Kofi vs. Shuni that battle who who you think put foot the boot more on Shuni Kofi or Miss Hustle wait wait time out oh yeah yeah no he's hundred percent right because I'm sorry Shuni battled Casey on that card Kofi and Shuni was hundred percent on URL pardon yourself. I'm I'm thinking about the Shuni versus Casey uh, battle that happened on that card, but yeah, nah. Okay, so and so yeah, hustle, lie. 30, and hustle thirty Shuni. Hustle yeah, it was the whole shit out Shuni. Shuni was choking at everything. Shuni gave Coffee a fight. Hustle was up there spinning on Shuni on Chrome on that Sony. Nah, Coffee kind of was wilding on Shuni. No, Shuni was getting off in that battle. Go back. Huh? Just go back. She ain't clearly beat no motherfucking Shuni. She didn't clearly beat no Shuni, nigga. I thought that was like a 30. Nah. I, yeah, because Shuni was choking. Like, Shuni, we love you. It ain't no. She was choking. Pause. No diddy. Okay, pause. So maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, but I ain't gonna front. That's old. But like, see, if we was on the panel, we would have refreshed our brain and went through all these battles. Like, with, but you know, that's something they gotta go. They gotta rewatch all the battles. Okay, and okay, cool. And I'm not listen. My my bad. I'm gonna get comfortable. My bad. Coffee won that clearly. Okay, y'all outvote me. But hustle beat her clearly nine months before that. Well, well wait, Coffee have Coffee huh? resume kind of crazy too on a low ski. She had 40, she had Shuni, she had Twerk, she had Snake Us, she had Geechee. <laughs> Y'all are crazy. I that's, a, that's, a good year. that's a good God. year. But she got her spirit lifted in one of them. Where's who? Twerk lifts her spirit. No, sir. No, yes. sir. No, sir. No, sir. He ain't lift her spirit. No, sir. Did he win the battle? You could debate that. He ain't lift her spirit. No, sir. No way. Hell nah. That's what that's what she was told. She was she was saying he had the shrimp and all that. Nah, she was well in that battle. She was well in that battle. I ain't gonna lie. Um, I ain't gonna lie, Wody. Y'all got a hell of a debate ahead of y'all. Y'all got a hell of a debate oh, ahead of y'all. Be fucking lying. How? Go ahead, man. Bro, she went crazy. What you mean? Okay. And it ain't that when Twerk finished his round man short because the crowd was yelling stop and he really stopped? Y'all remember that? I got memory like an elephant, nigga. Y'all remember that? Okay, I see a lot. Of, I see I agree, Polo. Okay. I know real niggas is in the building. I'm comfortable. Um, okay, Tone man short in the third day. I know I wasn't bugging. That's when he finished the shit in like 30 seconds. Pause. Oh, it was like a 45 seconds. The crowd was like, yo, yo, cut it out. And he really stopped. Okay, OTFMG said, yeah, that happened. Okay, okay. We in the building. Now, I'm listen, this debate. Bro, Rody, you didn't name all them. Bro, just because you tried to name OTFMG of Coffee, biggest supporter. Her and Josh is like best friend. You stay trying to name these little, like, okay. Now, like, no, that don't make that shit right. Let's make that clear. Wait, time out, time out, time out. Hold on, I don't want to like sound like no, I'm. Wait, 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 wait. I don't want to feel like I'm bugging. It's a hundred. I'm reading the chat with you. It's a lot of people saying twerk thirty up. You skipped over seventy niggas saying twerk thirty up. Nah, and name the I five motherfuckers them. to act like you was right 
and what was going on. Stop it, bro. Yo, let me ask y'all a question. Do y'all have hold up? Hold up. Do y'all have hold up? Do y'all have twerk? Do y'all have twerk clearly? Yo, it's a show, bro. Do y'all have twerk clearly beating coffee? Yes. In the chat. Let's just yo tone. Can you pull up a poll, please? Can you put up a poll, please? Oh fuck! Can somebody pull up a poll, please? Clearly beating coffee. That shit ain't even. That shit not even debatable. When did that become a thirty? When did niggas just yell like niggas just when be making y'all be making a all, thirty? Yo, y'all be making all battles a thirty. Like what? What is going on? That that's a thirty. That was a thirty. Wrap this shit up, man. That was a thirty. Stop it. It was her only loss. Coffee won the second round. No, nah, they did say twerk 30. A okay, okay, I'm gonna watch that again. I don't remember that being a 30. I could be wrong, you know, I could be wrong. <laughs> Lastly, I want to get to this though. Why we got a lot of people in here because I know a lot of people pulled up because they thought I was gonna be talking about this off rip for the people. Now, I put out this list on Twitter real quick my top 20 hip hop this of all time. Now, um, I see a lot of people fucking with the list. Number one, I had hit him up. Eat the number two, take over. Hundred shots, Young Dolph, back to back. Drake, Truth, Gucci, man. Stay strapped, Young Jeezy, back down fifty. Checkmate, Jada Kiss. The bridge is over. The bridge is over. I uh um boogie down productions. Three hundred bars and running the game. The first one, no Vaseline, Ice Cube, no Diddy. The 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 bitch and you in comment, no Diddy. Real motherfucking G's, Easy E. Throw your hands up, Beanie Siegel, son of Jada Kiss. Story of Don Pusha T. You gotta love it. Hold this camera. On. Salute the hold though. Control verse. T-shirts butted. I seen a lot of people put up their own list, so I definitely want people to put y'all list. Who y'all feel is um y'all favorite hip hop? This I need y'all. Y'all you know I mean to to definitely check it out. Cola. I want I want hey, what's what's some of your top this hip hop? This is Cola. First of all, back down was fire. But it's nothing more fight powerful than that Wangster, folk. Wangster was, Wangster was different, folk. That shit was like back to back. This national hit. He wild on him on that Wangster. Niggas try to overlook that Wangster. That's one. Let's keep it on, on it, on it, on it. Niggas also I, I did. over. Niggas also overlook. Nah, you you gotta listen to Back Down again. He was wild on the whole industry on Back Down. Back Down was cool, bro. But Wangster was he wild on that nigga. Like still a little commercial. It, it is, but that's the point of this shit. When you can make a when you can make a diss track go national like that, that's the art and the music, bro. When you just got something that just fire on the background, how fire is it if it ain't went national? That's what made back to back so crazy. That's what made Ether so crazy. If Ether this just was a local, just this, it wouldn't have been as what it was. But Ether was a national hit, bro. You play that fuck Jay Z right now. What's up, niggas? Niggas know that whole intro, G. No, Wangster is up there, but what, what's your list though? Like, I ain't really like what's like. What would you put as your top five? I, 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 I ain't. I can't even really in my mind. My top five. Yeah. Okay, off top right now, cause I ain't had no. Let me just tell the fans, I ain't had no thought process. This one a part of the show with me, Polo Kane with this shit. So don't kill me. But off the top, top five disses. You gotta, you gotta understand. Ether is in there. Ether is a top five disc. That's one. You gotta put Benny Siegel when he dissed Jada Kiss in there. That's yeah, I got it. that in there. Throw your hands up. That's epic. You gotta throw Siegel in there. Okay, that's two, right? Three. I, I feel like Takeover Blueprint. That's my shit. Takeover is in there, folks. They they can say what they want. Takeover is one of the craziest discs to me ever. That's just me. Mm -hmm. That's just me. Okay, that's three. Hold on, they want me to pull. Let me put it back up. They asked me to put the jump yeah, back up. Yeah, put your list cool. back up. Okay, back to back is not okay. Cool. Hit him up. Tupac is definitely in that post. So we write. So I got. I got. Yeah, hit him up. Hit, hit him, him up. up is, that that's up. like the ultimate. Like like if you listen to hit him, hit up, him up, the way he, he yeah. touched on shit that niggas wasn't even thinking about in this. Like the way he just like that was epic. Hit him up, beans, ether. Blueprint and put your list back up. Let me see. Let me see one more. Now. Let me see. I like. Truth up there. Stay strapped. Back down. Checkmate. Uh. Uh. 
300 balls and runners up there. Son of Kiss. Yo, people talk about that throw your hands up by Benny Siegel, but that's Son of Kiss. Listen to that, too. That's one of his greatest, y'all you know I mean, up there. Uh, you got to love it. That's the Jay-Z diss. We diss uh, uh, Cam, Cam. You the king of New York wearing chinkletas. That was a staple out here. Uh, the control verse. Yo, nigga, is nigga scared of Kendrick Lamar? Why nobody dropped it? Then we going to say that. Bro, that shit ain't enough pressure, nigga. That's, that's what we got to start remembering. See, niggas, the, niggas respond and not respond for two things. That shit either not hot enough or it's hot enough. Or it really, you really ain't pressure, nigga. Let's, let's stop acting like niggas act like they got to jump for this nigga. That's the point. They letting y'all know this is not a nigga we got to jump for. This one in the every 10-year album making ass nigga. He don't move us when we doing this shit every year, every other month. Back-to-back -back dropping his. Who the fuck is he that had a luxury that we supposed to have doing this shit on a consistent when this thing go have four kids, win a Pulitzer, then act like he the best? No, nigga, we gonna respond to you when we feel like it. Fuck you talking about. He ain't a warranted response. He not a hove, nigga. Hove is a warranted response, nigga. Man, fuck your Drake big three, nigga. It's response, just big nigga. me, nigga. Same thing, push it like, bro, that's when we gotta get to the fucking right back to the hip hop. Every one of you niggas that diss a nigga is not a warranty automatic response, nigga. You ain't got automatic response prestige, nigga. You got I get to you when I get to you prestige. Let's get to that. Hove told you niggas that. I'm going to get to you when I get to you. I don't got an automatic response because you push. I'm Drake. We don't even know what push at right now. Drake in the middle of another beef. That nigga pushing somewhere trying to do something else. Invest in the clothing line or do a model in Paris. Push it, duck the smoke. Now. Yo, push it, T. Duck the smoke from Jim. He ducked the smoke from Jim Jones. I, I can't push it, T. Duck the smoke. For, I lost a little bit of respect for Pusha T. Jim Jones, lyrical respect. Push it, T. Is Jim what Jones. I'm saying, Polo. Uh huh. Jim Jones. Y'all acting like Drake got to respond to him, but he can duck Jimmy. Jimmy is on his level. Jimmy is on Pusha level. Pusha shooting for a star as a street nigga. That he say he a street nigga, come shooting at him on the block freestyle, he going to hide. But he want to chase the light skin boy. Come on, man. I I, I want to say this, though. I'm hearing this. I'm hearing, I'm hearing, you know what I mean? I hit up so a, a lot of people. I'm hearing this a diss post to drop. They said uh, Drake had three sons in there. <laughs> a diss nah. post to drop for where? I had three sons. Out of all of this back to back, the only one to keep my name out. <laughs> Listen, man. Bro, stop I'm gonna be like y'all. Stop acting like y'all ain't hear that state scheme like you want this. He it was dissing on that. It bothers me when the gods when the, get to acting get like, act the like the uh -huh. Stop playing, bro. Hope all Latino come equipped with niggas like y'all. Let's, <laughs> let's keep it a hundred. Let's keep it a fucking hundred, bro. That nigga hold that had a thousand beefs. He only really addressed one head on. Everything else is few shots. And I'm off you niggas. Y'all not on my level. So y'all say he get to do it, but Drake got to respond to every fucking minion that say his name. Hove didn't. Hove went at Nas because it was hard and shoot at the other niggas. Dig a hole and shit like that. Cam, stop it. Everybody else just went around, get... man. Stop me, acting like me... this nigga Drake. Man, I'm, I'm artist of the fucking decade. Man, let you me... niggas better be happy I'm talking to you. Let me get to this nigga real quick right here, man. First and foremost, man, I can never be wilding because this is hip hop. Pusha T was a hundred percent supposed to respond to Jim Jones. Jim Jones called them out lyrical warfare time, nigga. Especially when you was on Go Time versus Drake, you was quiet versus, and you tried to diss him on the runway show. So he did kind of type respond. He just was scared to get into that lyrical warfare because Jim Jones had that pressure on him, nigga. That's the problem. Y'all got to start pushing niggas to respond hey, when needed. Hey. And you know them real, and you know them real niggas that's bulling the right way up in that VA area. You know they big bulling up in VA. He know, he know Jim Jones and that them NYBBA niggas got that lineage up through that way. Yeah, talk to yeah. You yeah, he got shit in right. Yeah, seven thirty. You know that yeah, one of the real seven thirties to be up there on his ass. He know what happened. Yeah, he was in the hood. He was in the hood chilling. <laughs> that nigga Jones get up out the chair, hit the weed, throw it on the ground, and get right uh -huh. with that nigga. <laughs> Fuck you talking about Capo. Yeah, we got we got to get Jim to pull back up, man. You talking about you don't, wanna, get... you don't want to rap with a real street nigga, but you want to you want to pick on the on the Yeah, on the I, I don't like that, right? Like... Stop it. And you went to his town and they threw water at you. 
Oh, they. <laughs> Come on, Matt. I ain't seen a nigga. That nigga Drake did 60 shows in VA. I ain't seen a nigga throw a water bottle at him. Stop. Yeah, I, I ain't gonna lie. Um, they said when was the last? Hey, I ain't gonna lie, man. I, I do want to see. Uh, I do. I would love to see a response this week from J. Cole. I want to see. This is the reason why Drake. I don't really care to see a response for because I understand. They got definitely yeah. beneath Drake, man. Yeah, it's Drake. Like, I feel like J. Cole, a nigga that's been on everybody featured, a boy that rapped in London, British, all kind of languages, for him to be on everybody's song talking about he the best rapper, for a nigga to come out and call him out and he just be quiet, that looks bad. That looks bad. Yeah. Especially Drake ain't running around talking about I'm I'm the greatest rat. Like he had Drake is like nigga, you know I'm the best. It's cool. I ain't gotta talk about it every song. I'm rapping to the bitches. J. Cole, every song you talk about you being the best rapper. Hey, Polo, let's keep it honest. Drake is on his 40th nigga dissing him at this point. <laughs> He's on his 40th rapper. Ross and I'm getting a tour with him. Me, uh, Puff Daddy, uh, Pusha, this nigga, that nigga. These niggas ain't even had a real beat. Kendrick and Cole ain't even had a real back and forth with a nigga yet. Bro, when you that and nigga, they all shoot at you. Same way Hove. When Hove was that nigga, they all was shooting at Hove. And Hove was pew, 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 niggas. Two, two niggas, like, yeah, you were filming getting niggas right up out of there with a quick verse. And I ain't gotta holler at you, bro. I'm a boss. I'm really dude, bro. I'm an artist of the fucking decade. You can't change that with that little Pulitzer and dude that's rapping on me. I just put him on his three biggest hits in the last six months, nigga. And I'm the first nigga to ever get that nigga a Roley. He rapped about that. J. Cole told y'all. I just uh -huh. explained Jane Roley and, and showed him love. I ain't got nothing against these niggas. I'm an author. You niggas better listen, keep stop fucking around. Listen, man. It's Drizzy. Don't what don't compare. Nas had to, Nas had to take three months to respond to takeover. Nigga, did you hear takeover? What Kendrick just did was not no takeover, take a three month break. Respectfully. He could have dropped the freestyle the next day on, on Kendrick if he wanted to. J. Cole. And let's keep it honey. Let's keep it honey, nigga. When Drake first dropped charged up on that nigga, y'all was acting like, like charged up was light as shit. That shit nah, shit charged up went crazy. I thought it went crazy. But niggas was like, oh, Drake got a then he dropped that back to back and broke their motherfucking head. Now you want that to charge the beat was so crazy. Like, that's one of the most underrated hip hop beats. Like, hey, niggas gotta listen to that charge up. Hey, Polo, now they want him to beef with a nigga that just come off of off, 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 off cultivating the farm and acting like he want to rap again. This nigga Kendrick just come back from growing crops, cabbage, uh, pears, peaches, and apples. And you niggas try to act like y'all hey, keep it a we got almost a thousand on Twitter. I'm going to keep it a stat. I ain't like that Kendrick was quiet during all this Black Power stuff with George Floyd and everybody. He was quiet as a mouse. They ain't going to come out with an album talking about he was quiet because he had to get peace. In my Nigga, you talk all this Black Panther shit. Now it's time to be a Black Panther. Niggas is quiet. I ain't like that. I ain't going to snap. Hold on. Ain't this main shit? Didn't he do the war show and chains and whips and the police? Yeah. And that? How the fuck you ain't the first on the time I was you? Yeah, because he over there cultivating the farm. And y'all let this nigga, nigga put out two albums in 10 years. Y'all act like he that. Like, get the fuck out of here. Could he rap good? Yeah. But he ain't put the work in nor the pain. The man just from a big coast, and they had to find somebody to give it to. And they said he was the next up in the West. And they got y'all got to stop that when y'all really don't want to keep it a hundred. And rest in peace, Nipsey Hustle. Nipsey really was the Geechee Gotti of the West of the hip hop. Kendrick is like disaster, one of them, and you niggas hanging on to it. Nipsey Hustle was really the Geechee Gotti of hip hop coming from the West. Uh, 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 un unexpected, untimely demise, and rest in peace and condolences rest to Nip and everybody that went through that. But Nipsey really was him. He's Geechee Gotti. That nigga K Dotty number disaster, one of them. That's true. <laughs> I ain't saying nah. Kendrick Moore, he his name up there a little bit more, man. Nipsey was really gonna be that on my baby. What they trying to make Kendrick? Nipsey really was, bro. And I ain't trying to make this no West, no West crime. What dude was marathon? It's a celebration. He was really talking that LA shit. Kendrick been out ten years. He ain't told me nothing about LA. Just a lot of good rapping. Women in the gunning line. You ain't like that, that, um, that recipe? That recipe go off. Man, he, he man, they told me, nigga ain't took me through L.A. on the tour of nothing. 
I don't know nothing about L.A. dealing with Kendrick that he just from there. Nipsey, I know some about it. The Game, I know some about it. Dr. Dre, I know some about it. Easy E, I know some about it. Even with DJ Quick and, and motherfucking Too Short and them being up, up the Bay, Oakland and all that, I know some about it. Kendrick haven't told me nothing about L.A., but he's a good rapper. Damn. Good kid, Mad City ain't take me nowhere through the Mad City. They said... <laughs> Nah, I ain't going front. Kendrick hit that uh that good kid, man. Shit, he definitely had me feeling like I was on the back block of LA. I ain't gonna lie. Man, you felt like you was at a poetry jam, nigga. And a nigga was telling you from a, a author standpoint, fuck out of here. You that nigga was telling you something from an author standpoint. Yeah, I said it. Y'all overhyped this nigga. <laughs> yeah, this nigga going crazy. Man, section 80, whatever, folk. All that shit. We talking about big boy shit. Nah, you well in section Man. 80. Listen, y'all. Listen, we tone tone listen to rock and roll. He's gonna <laughs> listen to every I can drop an album. Tone so hip hop. Me and Polo can do a joint album and tell Tone is out. He gonna listen to that motherfucker from front to back. And even if it ain't the goodest shit, y'all tone was saying, I ain't gonna lie, I see what y'all could have did good here. He's never gonna have an over bad critique. It gotta be piss poor, Uncle Deuce, 50 cent givers to that trying for tone not to like it. He's gonna find light out of the little thing. The little you don't thing. like that. What is it? I'm fucked up. Twelve boobies to the face, nigga. Fuck that. You don't like that? That ADHD? Yeah, because when well, you wrote that photo, <laughs> <laughs> the sales on GTA Five. We that's the point of the best. <laughs> Bro, that's one of the best songs on GTA Five. A fucked up. Twelve boobies to the face, nigga. <laughs> It's one of the best songs on TV. And Tone, y'all forgetting. Stop acting like y'all ain't watching me walk that boy down with Lupe in the Discord. I walked him down with Lupe. Y'all forgot I defeated k out with Lupe. So you can't say I beat him. Lupe walked that boy down. Y'all talking about all these lyrics. Y'all don't mention Big Crit. Another lyricism. A nigga from the South that can rap it. But y'all got K Dot because he want to pull us. Word, nigga, ni ni nigga, acting like Nipsey was gone for Matt. Nipsey was alive when all this Kendrick was out though, and that shit was quiet. That shit got real quiet when Nip started buzzing up. Shit got real quiet when the marathon started. Started. Shit got real quiet. That's when he started building that farm, and then he popped out on the. For the black, I ain't seen the man do a, a, a full gathering of nothing, of nothing, of nothing. Now, TV, nah, I think it's going dumb on Kendrick, boy. He's going to do a full drive. It's nowhere else. Well. Nowhere. I ain't seen him doing no empowerment talks around the nation or nothing like front leading or nothing like that. All the shit he talk about in his raps, I ain't seen him forefront around America. Nowhere. Come Nigga on, go Polo. Wow. Come Listen, y'all. I ain't seen that man going to do big speakers in New York or speakers in these in these impoverished neighborhoods. He talking all this poverty shit, but where's the leadership of it? Are you being on the front? Besides mm. in L.A. Mm. Come on, man. <laughs> Let's keep Listen. it real. You getting the life from the people that are Grammys and all the white people. Well, where's the work in front of the blacks? I ain't seen your ass in Chicago besides for a concert. What was you politically speaking at? About what's going on in here, because the same thing going on in LA going on here. Where's you on the forefront? Tupac was going around blasting this shit. We only seeing you when it's a rap. We ain't seeing you just going public talking about the issues in the neighborhoods and all that. So if you're gonna take this shit on, Kendrick, take this shit on. Don't front. Tupac took this shit on. Muhammad Ali took this shit on. Niggas that was really for it took this shit on. You playing with it through the music, but you ain't took this shit on. Y'all don't mm. wanna be honest. That nigga ain't not just speaking and speaking and speaking and going up in these He's not. He's just rapping, come get a check off this shit, and go away and act like he lived it. But we all lived it. Our story mm. is his story. Fuck out of here, bro. Y'all let these niggas tell. Y'all let these niggas come in here and rap and tell a story that's our story and act like it's over. Man, that's crazy. Bitch, we went through that too. Now what a work at to fix it. We went through that too. We seen niggas die. We got fucked up neighborhoods. What's more than just rapping about it? Because you're rich now. Now, that's true. Come on, man. Like, he definitely on. be he, he definitely was quiet when all, when all the George Floyd and all the shit, shit he quiet. was talking about on his album. He was quiet. 
At least well, J. Cole right. protested. Well, you gonna, bro, when well, you gonna be a motherfucker on the forefront, like Kareem and all them niggas, you putting this shit on. That nigga Muhammad put this shit on the front, bro. When you really putting this shit on the front, when you speaking about it, you putting this shit on the front before anything. We ain't getting from anything. Only time we hear from him in a route or at a Grammy or when he's gonna do a surprise show and now he in whips and chains. We ain't know he's about to do that show. We he just showed up and he in whips and chains and we all in front of the white people. But where's the work? Where's the grits? Where's the shit at? Where's mm. it at? That's a fact. I feel like on, rappers, man. if you're going you to talk this Black Power, Black Panther shit, when it's time to Wait be Black Power, say. Black Panther, you're going to have to be that. You can't just be quiet talking about you have to go on vacation to check out your farm and get your mind right. Ah, 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 nigga. This ain't the time to get your mind right, nigga. Talk all that shit you was Bro, talking on the first let's, album. Let's, let's keep it a hundred. Y'all know how much motherfucking mental, uh, mental awareness and mental health the niggas like Dr. King and Malcolm X and them niggas that was speaking was going through. Not only was they going through it, they taking on the burden of the other motherfuckers that's following them with this story. That's what you take on as a leader. You don't get to hide in the back when you trying to push this shit, but then you come push it, then you hide. Then you push it, win something, then you go away. Then you drop a rap and say you the best. You the best. Why? Because you're talking about the shit in the community that we already know. You can put great words together and tell us how we fucked up and what we went through. A lot of artists that told us that, nigga. We in 2024. We was born in the 80s. A lot of niggas in her poverty story after story after story. What is the movements for this shit now? Mm. Now for the people that's pulling up. Neighborhoods. For the people that's pulling up, we got we start talking about hip hop numbers. <laughs> um for the people that's pulling up, we talking about the Kendrick J. Cole. We talking about all the disses. Uh, you know, he's giving his take on what he feel Kendrick should do more of if he gonna be talking certain stuff. Um, it's no slander, it's no hate. We ain't on no sides. We just keeping it all the way a hundred. Um, uh, it's that I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna front, man. I ain't gonna lie. I definitely do. Like, I definitely agree with a lot of your takes. I ain't, I ain't gonna. I ain't mad at none of them to be honest. Um, he right, did. Man, and I want to say know. this because he said this guy right here said we looking for rappers. To be leaders. No, we looking for if rappers is you know, kids is listening. We want you to be about what you're talking about. Like if you're gonna be about empowering the community and doing all this stuff, then you gotta kinda be about that in real life. You can't just talk that on records. Ain't you know, ain't about being leaders and shit, but you should want the people that's that's uh influencing your kids to influence them in the right way, or if they listening to them for that, what are you talking about? If you like you sound crazy, respectfully. Um uh they said a bay nigga hit. I ain't gonna lie to chat. Y'all going crazy. Listen, we going definitely, we going to run this back. We, we'll be back again Tuesday right after Wody. We back again. Interviews. We we, 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 we going to try to do a lot, a few shows a week coming, uh, you know, for April. We going to try to turn it up a lot. Um, Yo, we got about damn near 25. Uh, hold on. Let me just get this right. Let me get everything right. I like to have the numbers right for the show. Um, How much shit not showing me on Twitter? Hold up. Okay, yeah, nah. So okay, okay, a little far. Okay, so we got eight hundred, about nine hundred on Twitter. And got about two thousand. So salute that two thousand plus on all streaming platforms. Rocking out with us, it's the Ball Guy Show. Like what Cola said, Polo BCM for uh questions, VIP. You want to come up here, talk your shit, promo whatever you got a promo. Hit that cash app. Y'all know what we do. Um, Ball Guy Show. We'll be back again. Um, Tuesday. We'll be back again Tuesday. Tomorrow we will be checking out all the women's final four. Shit, if that shit lit enough, niggas might pop up and do a sports show. We don't know. But salute to everybody in here tuning out, rocking out with the Ball Guy Show. Make sure you share this out, share this stream out. We did we did a lot of recap. We did a lot of everything. Cole, anything you want to say before we get out of here? Two things for certain. Again, raffle going down, starting ma. I'm back on the spaces for all you niggas want to argue and see why I got a very losing. Nigga, I'm coming with facts. I'm coming with bars. I'm coming with the whole nine. Make sure y'all in tune with that. We back on our shit at the end of the day, bro. We here. And nigga, my opinion and my opinion. We can we can argue this rap shit all day y'all want to. The man ain't dead shit. Drake ain't running around talking about Drake talking about bitches. So he all he talking about bitches. I hold him to that standard. Let me hear something. I'm on that certified lover boy shit. Well, I'm on that rap shit. The nigga been outside artist of the fucking decade for 15 years straight. Even when Wayne went down. That nigga Drake, I mean, that nigga uh, Kendrick ain't did enough in my opinion. Nor have J. Cole. 
J. Cole was little brother, little brother, till Hole put the arm around him. He went up. He was still so, crooked smile and all so, that, man. Let, like, let me ask you. Playing. Who do you think got the if if let's say J. Cole responds, Drake responds, and it's a war going? Who do you think got the most of game from all this back and forth for like out of all three of them? Who has the most of game? The mother niggas, bro. Think about it. Wait, who? Cause you're, you're, wait, wait, who? Cole or Kendrick. It's not it's not champagne poppy, nigga. I am the trend, bro. We set the mm. trend. I am the fucking trend, bro. All this shit. Because secondly, from a nigga changing to future being, last time future was hot before he was hot right now, and with these disses was with what? What a time to be alive. Who he was with? Champagne Poppy. Who Kanye shooting at right now to get back with? Champagne Poppy. Oh, they know where they got to come, bro. That shit, that's just like hope. Like, like, nigga can talk that shit, bro. None of them is fucking with dude, bro. Consistently. We talk about mm. the element of hip hop. Fuck with. We talk about just words. He haven't consistently show us with just words. He can even run the game like dude. Dude was on remix after remix after remix after remix. So wait, wait. Let's put I accolades mean, aside. Rap wise, lyric lyric wise, who you think has them lyrically? Who you think? I, you don't think Drake got a lot to gain from going into a beef with Kendrick and beating Kendrick lyrically? You don't think he got a lot to gain from that? This is what I'm trying to tell you, Polo. Drake did so much rapping, rapping. He was lyrical. To, he was over lyrical the first four to five years. Go listen to the albums. Y'all, y'all forgot. Y'all forgot Paris and all this shit. Uh, 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 all this, all this, all this. Uh, pineapple dice, pineapples, and all this type of shit. He rapping on it and, and ignorant shit and all this. Y'all forgot the rapping the boy did. When I'm rapping so consistently, consistently as I rap as being artists of the decade. How long I'm just gonna be rapping this lyrical shit? I gotta talk to the bitches. I gotta get on my money shit. I gotta somebody gonna make me fuck around and catch a body like that. I gotta get certified lover boy. I gotta get in different pockets because my consistency is making me have to switch up. When I sit back for three, four years and just give you bars, of course you can say what I will do or what I can do, but I have shown you what I do. See, that's the problem with niggas. I ain't going to lie. The chat going crazy for J. Cole. Listen, same thing with, listen, J. Cole ain't did it long enough, bro. I give J. Cole what? a little, I, listen, I give him the accolades of, of no features and all that. But, bro, as a nigga that's been hot consistently since we laid eyes on him, J. Cole, Noah Kendrick have done it. That boy. What? Shot, no, bro, J. Cole been hot. They been hot now. Listen Come on now. Polo, Polo. Drake been hot literally, no bullshit, Polo, since probably 08, 09, bro. We in 2024, Polo. Can't been hot since Drake. he came out. Bro, no, yeah, they ain't put out consistent music to be, be hot when he came out. Drake has put, listen to what I'm saying, bro. Consistently, Drake has been on the music charts and going crazy in this shit since like 2009, Polo. We in 2024. Nigga, J. Cole been doing it for damn near the same. What you talking about, J. Cole? No, no, They no. all came out around the same era. Bro, and Drake dominated since they came out till now. Them niggas that- they, they all dominated. Bro, them niggas had a- Bro, Polo, them niggas had a- A splash here and there. So, babe, them niggas ain't had- That nigga been a fireball from the Ripter. When he's still hot right now. Wait, Ooh, wait, 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 Drake is not the number one rapper to a lot of people right now. He ain't got to be the number one rapper, but the uh, but the stats say he the number one artist. Fuck what you think in your mind. We talking about what has happened, not what you trying to logically think because a nigga rapping. We talking about what has to, Polo, if I'm steady getting injured, and yeah, I may average 30, but since I've seen Polo since 09, he's been averaging 30, going to All-Star games, winning finals, and winning trophies. Who's is a better motherfucker, Polo? I don't give a mm. fuck about the what ifs. If you've been doing this shit, Polo, even though I'm an average 30 when I'm healthy and all that, when I come out, when you see me on the floor, Anthony Davis, you call him street clothes. When we see AD, we know he's going to be buckets, but that's if we're going to see him. One thing you know about LeBron, we going to see him. He consistently there. He consistently putting in buckets. Feature here, feature there, album. This, this, and that. He got Cali going platinum. New nigga going platinum. This is consistently. Who is the better nigga? So you trying to say, since they came out, not album sales or anything, you trying to say, since they came out, Drake has been rapping better lyrically than J. Cole and Kendrick? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
consistently mm. from Styles. Man, one of them niggas that did has went and did no Afro beat shit. None of them niggas went in that controller pocket. None of them niggas went in that. She used to call me on my cell phone. None of them niggas can even go to them ranges. None of them niggas can do it all night. I swear I'm changing. They can't do that, Polo. That's a different type of artist, bro. Bitches, niggas, hood shit, God's plan type shit. What are we talking about? It's not consistently. Yeah, yeah. We not talking about if a nigga just came and put it out. We come out for fifteen years. <laughs> Yo, told said so. Wait, they can't sing. <laughs> no, the niggas can't sing. Boy, we ain't talking about rap, nigga. We talking about hip hop. We ain't talking about all the singing one night. When nigga, what's up with them raps? Okay, so let's get to the raps. Uh huh. I ain't have Migos going crazy with my remix when I when I went crazy on Versace. Everybody try to get Gucci the credit, but after Drake got on that Versace, what happened with Migos? They blew up. Okay, cool. Future was going crazy in the trap. Don't astronauts all that shit was going crazy. When you heard that Tony Montana remix with with OVO Kid, what happened? What else happened with What a Time to Be Alive? I'm gonna keep it all the way real with you on everything I love. That Tony Montana was buzzing. I, I didn't even know Drake was on the ring. I when he got on that remix, first he get to pop it. Passenger Stallion. Is you crazy? Okay. What happened with your boy? Lil Baby. Who was on this shit? Nah, Lil Baby blew up from that freestyle. Hold up that baby. After that's me. We sing I'm on that bitch with TV. I'm in that bitch with Fuchi. After, after that, but right before then, we seen him and Drake with the red and black video all red. In the Lambos do it. We ain't saying a song, but we sing them with Champagne Poppy. Okay, who else kept, who else another nigga, the reason he been drowning, who was saving him with all the features he kept getting before he went against the gray? Once Meek Mill went against Drake, what happened to Meek Mill? The whole world spent on him. After what one do Drake, Drake went at what Meek, do any one of these, do any one of these niggas got a freestyle like Simba Freestyle? What? The Simba Freestyle. It's one of the best freestyles in hip hop from J. Cole. Freestyle? Bro, this one, Polo. This is we talking one. rap. You keep, this every is, time you talk, hey, Drake, you go to the sounds. Hey, you know, you know, you know, you know why I got to go to the sounds? Because the nigga that made so much music, you can remember one or two freestyles from them. This nigga got 40 freestyles. You don't know what to choose. I don't know what the even could. You can choose the five. This nigga got 15 years of just crazy music. I don't know what the particularly. I don't know if I want to go early, middle, or end Drake. It never ends. Do right and kill everything. Kendrick got that too, though. Kendrick, Kendrick resume is kind of crazy. His earlier good kid section 80. Good kid, Mad City to Pippa Butterfly. He he got he got he got a lot oh, of he got a lot of shit. Oh, and oh. don't forget, don't forget they got that untitled mixtape where he was hey, fake Polo. tearing J. Cole up on some of them hey, songs. Hey Polo. Uh-huh. The nigga got three albums in 15 years. How could he even be talking to me? This Drizzy. How is he? How y'all even playing with me with this nigga? When if Ho better than me or this nigga, y'all was just asking if I'm better than Ho. How y'all got me all the way back here? It don't make it's not even logical. Y'all was just asking if I'm the next nigga after Ho. How's I'm back to this nigga? Y'all just had y'all just was debating if I'm better than Wayne. How's I'm back to these these niggas fighting between each other? I'm drizzy. It's because he 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 kind of with all the singing shit, niggas forgot he could really rap. Man, this shit about hits, bro. The biggest, the what? Biggest Yo, Tone is going blood in the comments. Man, he said, Tone. who's asking if he better than Ho? Someone on dust? Man, listen, <laughs> listen. Tone think Danny Brown and them is like at the echelon. Like, I don't listen to Tone when it comes to hip hop. Danny. <laughs> nigga think Danny Brown and these niggas Earl. Crazy, nigga think Earl T-shirt and them is the best. Like, I don't listen to Tone. Tone is crazy. Kush bro. got a nigga feeling awesome. That nigga Tom gonna listen to Diana Ross today and, and Limp Biscuit tomorrow. I'm not listening to this nigga. Hey this now, nigga, you're an all-star. <laughs> Get your game on. Go hey, hey, play. Hey, yeah. Don't be hey, doing the guitars with an all-star. Get your Living game on. Living my life right down, walking around. Tom might listen to anything. I'm not taking this nigga. His, his music go off his emotions. 
That nigga may be on a run and want to do fight the power with that B. I'm not with him with him. Like, I let them type of niggas do what they do. This me and Paul, we talking about me and Polo type of rap. That nigga started listening to some <laughs> classical. You and his no, I listen to a lot of music, music. Too, but I understand what you're saying. Some debates. Now, listen. Because I ain't going front. The numbers jumped up super crazy when we started talking about hip hop. We definitely, totally I'm, a dro- so look, I'm dropping the mixtape Mount Rushmore part two. I'm dropping that. Um, and then we we gonna pull up and do another show on that for sure. We definitely break that break down the whole history of the mixtapes and all that. Cause you put because you put that out for Tone just lying about. What he say? Play. I listen to more street shit than both of y'all. Boy, stop it, Tone. So I just got a complaint for nigga, my you business from bumping no too much fucking. None of that, nigga. You ain't in the. You ain't listening huh? to these boss man D lows and shit. You yeah, what? Like trap shit, nigga. What? I can make the dope stretch. I can teach finesse, and I'm about my check. Yo, come on, Tone. You, you, you ain't listening. You, you, you. Come on, Tone. You ain't listening to no core. You ain't listening to no core from Philly or none of that, nigga. You ain't in the trenches. You wasn't listening to S the G before me. What? No G before me, nigga. Is you crazy? Riata Tone, block, I was nigga. outside. Tone. Block, I was outside listening to all that tone. They play that everywhere I'm at. Tone, I don't know what you're talking Rome about. Rose Street. Yeah, hey. Yo, Tone said he was listening to 38 before me. Tone, I knew what, bro. Tone, I knew these niggas when they was rapping with Mayhem, Loren, and Action Bronson. Nigga, do your research. Man, you what you talking out. about? Man, tone, you ain't talking to no new nigga. Tone just work out a lot, y'all, so his shit be on shuffle. He ain't listen to more street shit than me. He ain't listen to OC720. That nigga ain't. That nigga he ain't, ain't listening to no money. He ain't listen to none of that, man. Tone listen. No, he don't know about no OC7. Hey, he don't know about no Vaughn off, off, off 1700. These niggas, this nigga ain't listening to Vaughn off 1700. This nigga's about more street shit. This nigga not listening to these niggas, bro. Who he talking to? Talk nigga to not this listening nigga. to these niggas. I don't know what Tone talk about. Tone listen no more damn street music than that. Tone, let me see your recent. What's your recent Spotify look like, nigga? You what's your bar. recent Spotify? What's your recent Spotify look like? What's your what's your searches look like, nigga? What's your searches look like? You don't you ain't listen. What's your searches look? What what you what you talking about, Tone? Tone ain't listening to none of them niggas, man. Stop. Tone man. ain't listening to that shit, man. Tone, what are you talking about? Um. And and rotten wrong streets, bro. Them niggas is backpackers. Them not no street like the wrong streets and rock. Them that's like backpack street rap. Like that's not like no dope selling trap. Like what we what street rap you talking about? Struggle rap, man. Ain't no street rap, niggas struggling. Niggas that's like hey, yo. I had a slice of pizza and I went to the store with the Versace. Like that's that fly. Like. That ain't like, no, nah, I'm in the trap on a stove for burners. Like, that ain't that type of rap. What you talking like, about, bro? No motherfucking cocaine music. is none of that no trap. Man. I don't think they... Niggas just start talking about fentanyl and all that. Acting like these niggas in the trap, man. Niggas ain't in no trap, Tom. It's all wild. You ain't listen to no Leaf Ward, nigga. We listen to Leaf, nigga. Leaf. But listen, man. We we <laughs> oh we, nah tone definitely do listen to a lot of a lot, a lot of uh backpack music though he he fired though but the street shit tone that's our lane man come on now tone stop yeah. it it's all crazy you naming wrong streets in a in in a in a in a in what in the street like come on man why why tb facts facts what he so like what's he talking about. My nigga, baby Tron. Like you ain't, you ain't listening to no real. You ain't listening to none of that, man. Um, listen, y'all. Salute to everybody in here. It's been, it's been. It's, salute to everybody rocking with us, man. We gonna be back this week. We live. We back. Share this out. Clip this out. Share this. With, you know what I mean? We talked a lot. I gotta edit this up, man. Salute to everybody. We be back. I ain't gonna lie. We applying that pressure full court. Yeah, we applying. I just wanna pressure, say that. Man. Y'all niggas on full court. Bro. I don't know about no music. And we talking this hip-hop shit. We ain't just talking about battle rap this year. Salute to everybody, but we on everything. We on everything. Don't stop it. Ball guy show. We out of here. Beat it.